Holy moly. Holy moly. Uh, oh, hi. Um, hello. Uh, I'm Squint. Remember me. I, I do these streams. Uh, 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 wait, no. I want to back out. Uh, <laughs> hi, everyone. Starting off strong this time. Hope everyone's doing well. Gonna be playing Party Manimal. I always call it Party Manimal. Excuse me. I like the word Manimal. It's very goofy, and it's actually a word. Look it up. Streamer gaslights audience for the first time. And then we'll be playing Fallout 3. We're ever inching closer to the end of that. And I'm ever inching closer to uploading the past two episodes of it. Uh, do I have someone hanging out? I will be playing Party Animal with Maple, hopefully, sometime tonight. But we'll start off with a solo. I have not been playing this game lately. I have been whew, playing RuneScape, as you can probably imagine. Ever since that event, I've just been... that That's been my main outer game. What if, what if instead of playing Fallout tonight, we play Fortnite? How about that, folks? Would you like to see that? Can we get a, a show of hands of who would like to see Fortnite instead of Fallout 3? <laughs> oh, hi, Punk Chef. Currently playing COD. Whoa. I hope you fish up a big one. Hope you're reeling a big COD. Oh. It's usually around 40 seconds. I like Fluffy. Give me Fluffy. Oh, it's gonna be... Oh, it could be Fluffy! Damn it! <laughs> it was so close! Oh. Oh, no. I will give us audio in a moment, folks. I haven't streamed since... Since Thursday. Can you believe it? It's Saturday. I, I, I haven't streamed in... One whole day. Uh, oh. I could have sworn would be groups of four. Let's be Cavalier. The audio seems a little delayed on my end. But that's okay. Huh. Yes. Good. Oh, okay, bye. Oh, it might be the headphones I'm using. That might be why there's a delay. I'm using Bluetooth instead of my aux right now, because I still haven't picked up a new aux cord. I was having issues with my current aux cord. On my Bluetooth to, uh... Oh. I have headphones that I use that are, like, the ones that have a hole that you can put an aux cord in. But then, besides that, they are Bluetooth. I just know there's going to be, like, least latency if it's going to be aux cord. So that's why we like the ox. Oxes in this house. Oxes and the cows. The audio being delayed on my end isn't really affecting my gameplay. I really use sound too much in this game. Oh god. I feel like you could guess that from how I mute the audio a bunch. When the audio is muted, though, it's not, like, muted on my end. It's just muted on the, uh, your end. On your rear end. Oh my god, I can do it. No, fuck. No, don't, don't, don't tase me, bro. Thank you. No, not my kitty. Like, audio is helpful. A lot of audio cues in this game, like when people are knocked out officially. I'm just, oh, I just really want that. Really want to get this achievement. Put the gun to the side just in case we can cream the crop. No, that's not the phrase. No. Oh, come on. 
fine. Fuck you, puppy. Poppy. The fuck? Someone was up there. Oh, I'm not getting the achievement this time. Nope. Oh god. I get the dub. Nope. Oof. Meow. Meow, that's right. Was Meowth the first short king? I will debate that. In favor. I'm on the... the pro's side. Oh. Yeah, pro is Prius. Oh god. Good. <laughs> I deserved it. Got greedy. There we go. No. There we go. Yes! Woo! Oh my god, he got the diagonal kick off. <laughs> Damn. He's trying. He's trying. Oh, they're trying. Get out of here. You. Okay. Oh no. I mean, they're, they're kind of struggling. Oh, I thought that was the ice gun for a sec. I would have been so happy. I Maybe mean, I can spawn the ice gun. Come on. Come on, spawn the ice gun. Damn it, that's not the ice gun. <sighs> okay, well this is pretty useful though, for actually fighting. This round is very sumo wrestler-esque, so... This thing being able to like, push people out is so good. Get out of here. Oh, okay. Good goodbye. There we go. Trying to scoop. He's scooping. Everyone wanted to be invisible. Oh. Oh. thing about you being knocked out in this game is that like even if it's delayed for me um if i like the sound of me getting knocked out is delayed i still i still can't do anything for the first like you know like four seconds of being knocked out so that information being delayed for me doesn't like affect anything which is pretty neat it's not like, crucial that i know i'm knocked out instantly because your controls are just disabled for a whole, like, like, four seconds or whatever. I'm trying. Oh. 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 Save him. Okay. Cool. Okay, thanks, guy. Good work. Oh, 
What a surprise. Goodbye. Damn ice gun. Hmm. Okay. That's a lot of bombage. Oh. My god. I deserve this death. Oh, 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 so close. Oh, rude. So mean to the kitty. Oh. It's okay. Oh. I almost punched my partner out. Dog has something against me. I think it's a racket. Oh, actually. It's pretty neat. I can get this. Mm. Oh, oh, it's gonna be hard to get it. Karen wants to grab the nose ring instead. Oh, ho, ho. And this is working out pretty well. The frying pan can kill me. The racket, I don't think, could kill me that easily. Tommy. Hang out here for a sec. Aw, oh, damn, he got me. Got my ass good. How do you do that? <laughs> I don't even know how they did that. All I'm saying is in situations like that, you should be able to let your partner know pretty clearly that you're in danger. It would have been nice. Hmm. Oh my god. Dingus. <laughs> your TikTok isn't doing well lately? What do you mean? Has your algorithm been betraying you? Does your TikTok make you go doki doki? I feel like TikTok and doki doki they sound similar. Just not pushing out my TikToks. So you're saying you haven't been posting as much? I know how you feel. Times are tough, man. I mean, being a social media celeb, they expect you to do things. I don't. I don't agree. I don't agree with that status. Like, me, I think a, a neat little charm about my streams is that I don't stream all the time. You'll see all these other, like, people who call themselves streamers. They'll be streaming, like, every single day. I try to give you all, like, a little break every so often in case you have, like, RuneScape to play or something. I wouldn't, wouldn't want, you know, things to get stale with me, like, playing all the time. I mean, I know you need your you time, too, so... That's something that a lot of streamers can't give you. A lot of streamers, they'll they'll really just be in your face. Me, I'll I'll let you I'll, I'll take a back seat for a second. Uh, I'll just make it ever ever more special when I stream, right? <laughs> I feel I feel like social media should be like that. Just just give your audience a break, and uh, they'll appreciate that. I think. You can't love bomb your audience. You gotta. It's gotta be a, a, a like a tide, like the tides, like the moon. It pushes and pulls. Okay, I deserve this. <laughs> that person knows how to save their partner. It's like poetry. It rhymes. So that rhymes. I want to help my partner out. I hope we win. I hope, uh... Oh, that's not looking good. Blue team is <laughs> in the lead. There. Damn it. Okay, I kind of effed my... Moo! People are in my chat. Saw a toast in the corner say moo. How does, how does this... Moo. 
my friends playing? How does this work? Moo. Hello. Uh. How do I... I can't talk to my friends. Oh, you're in game now. Okay, well, hopefully this guy loses right now because uh, it looks like we're about to lose, so... We can hop in and play. His movement, hello. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Blue team is hurting right now. Oh. Oh, come on. I believe in him, even though I want us to lose. Um, Do this, do this. Oh, they got their fish first. Close. Oh well. I guess I'll have to play with my friends and my moo. And my moo friends. Because Toast did moo. Oh, oh. <laughs> Snuck in that GG. No big deal. We don't have to talk about it. Moo. Give movement a sec. Heart animals being silly. It was being silly for me too. I had to like, I had to reset my computer before it started being not weird. It's like the 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 app just wouldn't open. Oh right, I forgot this music might be uh, copywritten. Creative Commons. I like to put my videos under Creative Commons. You have two different like. Oh, I forgot what they call them. I'll look it up right now. On YouTube. When you release your content, you can choose Creative Commons to say that, like, your media is okay for people to use in other media. I'm gonna pretend I'm going live. I wouldn't actually want to go live now, would I? Reuse. It's under the setting called License. License types, Creative Commons, Creative Commons on YouTube. The ability to mark uploaded videos with the Creative Commons license is available to all creators. The standard... <clears throat> Let me take a sip. <laughs> the standard YouTube license remains the default setting for all uploads. Okay. Creative Commons licenses are only to be used on 100% original content. If there is a content ID claim on your video, you cannot mark your video under Creative License. Okay, Creative Commons license. Creative Commons license gives a standard way to, for content creators to grant someone else permission to use their work. So that's what I was looking for. Anyway, any whom. Any moom. Uh, Maple, you invite me. <laughs> I like it when you're the captain. Because I never know when to rematch people. In all other situations, I like being in control. But in this one, it, it makes sense because I don't know. I don't have, I don't have a connection to uh, rematching. Also, uh, you have Toast if you want to play. Oh, never mind. <laughs> if you want to back out, Maple, I think Toast is in. I don't know if Cobra wants to play or not. Our friend Cobra. Nice. Let's a go. Unless we, we're waiting for Cody. Oh no. Nice. Oh, I can't even write Moom. Oh, B hole. Oh, bridge. Okay, I guess we're playing bridge. Cody, are you playing uh, bu Bulatro? Is that the card you're playing? I know. I thought I thought Toast got that game, but you, you might have as well. 
I know it's like currently 10% off. Steam likes to make little sales. <laughs> Sorry. If I'm being honest, I think I'm developing a, a, a canker of sorts. If it isn't obvious by the, the, the S's in my voice right now. Oh man, T Pain. Min and Max. Oh, there's so many mooses. They're all meese. If it's going to be four meese, I'm going to be so happy. Oh my god, it's four Mises. Look at them. Oh, they're all different. Okay, bye. <laughs> um, I think I didn't, like, instantly... I didn't, how my friends like to call it, I love cheating. Aw. Aw. No! No! Flowerman! No! <laughs> No! <laughs> oh, that was my bomb. Careful, Min. Just hold on for dear life. Oh, good try. That was really good. <laughs> I'm surprised it just went down to 1v1. Oh, sorry. That's you, Toast. You're safe. The poor meat moose sounds. There we go. This is going good. Oh god, the the bridge is about to tear in half actually. Oh my god. Oh damn. Good, we won. Woo! <laughs> Thanks for grabbing me. <laughs> Aw. Damn it, I keep forgetting you're on my side, Toast. Why do I forgetting this every time? <laughs> so funny. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't know how. I swear, it's like an, a, a reflex when I see, like, a, the sharks for some reason. <laughs> I never have people on my team that play as sharks, I guess. I always assume that they're going to be, like, the enemy. No! Woo! <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Oh, I've earned this. Nice. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> nice. Oh. This is interesting. Oh. I'll just leave you guys to it. Okay. Nope. Sorry to, uh... Just leave you two to it. Oh, God. No. Oh, 
Oh, good job, you two. Hell yeah. Oh, no game audio. Fuck me. It wasn't intended. Thanks, Cody. <laughs> GG. Of course. Of course, no game audio. Why would I expect any better? Woo. I appreciate the call out. Now the game audio is muted on purpose. Even on porpoise. Two eggs. Come on, give me a good one. I haven't played for a couple days, so you owe me a, a new unlock. Oh, it's a gray. Oh, a cutie. I already have him. Oh, I think I have all the blues already. Oh, but I love him. Okay, I'm in. <gasps> Ooh, a quick match. Trebuchet is fun. Oh, no dice. The audio is like muffled between the loading screens, which I feel like wouldn't be caught by uh, content, whatever it's called. Content aware scale. That's what it's called. No, um, it's automated copyright stuff. Oh. Like, you can always tell which one's Moomin. Because she'll be matching me. Benoy. I want that RGB bunny. <laughs> I feel like they won't bring it back until the next uh, Lunar New Year's. That's the bunny. So they will bring it back for another like 11 years or so. <laughs> Who died? Was it was it a rando? No, I don't think so. There we go. Oh, someone got iced. I didn't see who, I just heard it. Nice. Stay out of your way. Oh god. Right, you're here. Oh, I fuck me. Fuck me, mate. Boy, fuck me, mate. Fucking Vegemite. Ugh, I got fucked. I'm dead. I've been watching so much of this YouTuber named Dank Pods. He's really funny. I recommend him. His, all, of his, all of his videos are the same and they're all really fun. He's like... He's like an audiophile, but also, like, he just reviews the crappiest, like, MP3s ever. And he's Australian as fuck. And he always plays, like, like, jaunty Australian, uh, patriotic music. And, uh, just, it's, it's the best time. He's always, like, screaming. <laughs> and he has this, like, rock that he keeps on his desk called the One Grit. As if, like, sandpaper, the higher grit you get, or the lower the grit, the rougher it is. So, he just has a rock that's called One Grit. And he, <laughs> he'll always, like, fucking smash the hell out of the MP3 players that are that are crappy. Which is, like, all the ones that he reviews. It's 
he gets like the trashiest used shit just to like <laughs> kind of make fun of them and how naive we were like just 10 10 to 15 years ago but yeah it's just it's it's a great time i, I recommend dank po dank pods i think his name is he's also a drummer and he has a pet uh snake named frank he always talks about how dumb frank is <laughs> He ends all of his videos with a, like, at least few second long clip of Frank just, just being goofy in her tank or whatever. Oh, Frank is a girl, by the way. She was named Frank before they sexed her. And she was just a, just a little wee, wee garden looking snake. Now she's gotten a lot, very big. Apparently she eats once a month. And she eats quail. <laughs> Sorry, Dank Pods, I just ruined your whole show. I, I just said every single aspect of it. Now people don't even have to watch it. Oh, damn, he survived. Good job, Mopa. That was awesome. Oh, she went down with the ship. Well done, Maple. For some reason, I just realized we were like 4v4. Like, I knew there were three of us, but... Just got killed by Eminem. Is Eminem in COD? I know he's in Fortnite. I know, uh... I know Cardi B is... I don't know. Someone is... Some female rapper. No woman! Got his ass. Oh no. Just <laughs> punching them over and over. <laughs> I actually kill them. Oh, close. I'm gonna knock them out with my fists. I gotta reduce their meter. Fuck! Oh, it's bad. I'm spamming. Yes, 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 yes. We're good. Woman, hello. Recover some stamina. At least I am. This isn't looking hot, but I've seen hotter. I've seen colder. Yes. Mutiny. Yes. Starship. Yes, ass. Yes. Thank you for letting me have that. <laughs> I saw you coming into frame for with the backup. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? <laughs> How'd you do that? 
Let's bully them. Oh, no. <laughs> Thank you. Woo. Oops. Whoa, you can like flick them off of you with kicks. Watch out for that one. Goodbye. Oh, invisibility would help you. Oh, that, okay. So I'll get revenge, don't they? Yep. Fair enough, fair enough. Eye for an eye. Toe for a thigh. Cool for a white guy. <laughs> Guys. Oh. She mooing. She mooing. Fuck. No. Ah. This <laughs> is Good cow try. I see Toast back there still. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it almost works. <laughs> to a degree. Tommy. No! Uh, uh, I reap. I reap what I sow. Okay, that's two of them. Oh, we're gonna glow. Yes! <laughs> That's bad. Good luck with the cat. It's 2v1, I think. Oh no, Maple, no! Careful toast. Got her ass. Yes, that was my fish. Oh, good try. No! <laughs> the screaming cat. No! Oh, that was really close. <laughs> Defeat. Alright, you know what? That's it. Died over. <laughs> it's died, Soda. <laughs> Yay! Oh, we waltz. Woo! Yes. <laughs> I love that reaction of when something happens. And it's like, you know what? Diet over. <laughs> Losing this diet. Can't deal with this. <laughs> Ice. Ice president. Vice nice President Dick Cheney. Oh no. Kept getting worse. Oh. I got a bull terrier. I like what I see. I think bull terriers 
in real life and in this game are so good. <laughs> They're so damn cute. I love the shape of their face. Oh. I like the shape of a lot of faces. On animals and on maple. Which is in the shape of a cow. Should I be mean? I should save Maple. Oh. Oh, hi. Oh. It's, it's definitely a coin flip. If I say, oh, hi, how likely I am to say, Ohio. Because half of the- it really is about half and half how often I do, where I go, just- I just say Ohio. Or lead it up with Ohio. Wow. Really deep conversations on this one, huh? Oh, fuck. Goodbye. Oh, Moomin. I do like how you're a white cat, as if you were a Moomin. I mean, you are a Moomin, but you know. In the game, I mean. <laughs> the turnaround. Sorry, Maple. Good job, recovering. Oh shit, I didn't know he was up. No! Oh! Oh, I'm sorry for killing you, Mopa. I really didn't mean to. Y'all did very well. I just ruined it in the end. Oh, hi. 50-50 chance, folks. So, when it comes to gender neutral, like, oh god, I, I deserve this. Like, groups of people name, like, there, there's y'all, and there's folks, you know, there's a audience. Um, I am a big fan of folks. I like sometimes pronouncing the L, sometimes I won't. We're going on 50-50s here. Hi, Mopa. Um. But one of the reasons I love folk folks so much is because it makes me think of Animal Crossing City folks. Which I think is like the cutest title ever. <laughs> I love that's the pref this the suffix for it, whatever. It's it's so good. <laughs> it's a city folk. I don't know, something about it, it, it the fact that it's city and then folk. It's like you're, you're getting you're getting the best of both worlds. You're getting like getting that fun rural experience, but also a moment. Hello. Yes, we're glowing. Yes. And we're eating a lollipop together. You're getting that rural aspect to it of you're like you know doing whatever in your town, but then also you get to go into the big city. You get to be a cow in the big city. Stomping her hooves around. Being a statue on Wolf Wall Street that people like to rub. Hello. Sorry, I'm kind of doing the playing the game for everyone. Oh. <laughs> Okay. 
I, I need to stop that. Thank you. No, Maple. Thank you. No, I meant heart. <laughs> Not cry. No. Oh, this has been a long time coming. Nice. Sorry, Toast. Oh, I wasn't much better with those. Damn it! I got healed by my own hubis. <laughs> the bomb was funny, by the way. I, I want you to know I found that... <laughs> I liked it a lot. I feel like it was karmatic for, for how mean I was being to the other team. <laughs> Damn, you're really grilling them. Oh my god, no, they switched. <laughs> no, why is he choosing? No! No! <laughs> Cat scrum. Look, Toast. We had to go through much adversity with me and my nunchucks, so. There's a reason you did. You got here. It's because you're good. Oh my gosh. That was actually a really good strat to hold behind their head. You were like grabbing their scruff. Ah. <laughs> oh. Good try. A little trick to pull on your cats. Hold their scruff. No, don't do that. But if you do want to check how hydrated they are, there is a, a legal a, a doctor trick where they they do use the scruff to test that. Oh, this guy like gave up. No. Oh my god. Okay. Oh. I might die. I died. Oh, good luck, Maple. Nice. Well, the nunchucks are... Whoa. The nunchucks are acting really weird on the uh, perspective, the spectator camera. I didn't know how much they, like, jitter around. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, very good try. Oh, it's not over yet. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> good job. Good try. I blame Eminem. And I blame MLM. Moopa. Oh, one DC'd. Moopa. Nice. Oh. A treat. What do we get? What do we get? Give us a Nemo. That ain't a Nemo buck. Not bad, though. I need to do two more headbutts. And I need to knock out 15 more... Uh, drop kick. 11 more people. Before I get that XP boost.
No, with the Chabon if we can. Or afloat, either one. Nice. This one feels good with a, a group of people. I was going to say a group of furries, but that would be way too presumptuous. Click, bla click b back on the game. Hello. Oh, did you want to join? Oh, the game audio is out. Okay, so I try to keep it off when it's, uh, thank you for the reminding me. I try keeping it off when I'm going between menus. Um. Whenever I go back to, like, the main menu screens, I keep them, keep it off because it can get content claimed. Because the, uh, for some reason it's licensed music. This game has licensed music between, on the main screen. Oops, sorry. Sorry, Tin Mutt. Tin Mutt 2. Thank you for the help. Sorry. Dad. Shouldn't have uh, test. Shouldn't have tested fate there. Oh, cool. Okay, I'm deadly. Put this now. killed them. Sorry, I was really focused on murder. <laughs> I, I was really quiet for most of that. Um, oh, these guys are really tough. I was just really committed. Taking it serious. Really sweating. Forgot I was streaming. Get out of here. Okay, I mean, their partner got dunked on. Okay, at least I'm safe. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oops. It's okay. Boom! Oh. Fine. Feeling just fine. Oops, sorry. You're not the boss of me now. Oh, <laughs> that was really funny in slow motion. Thank you. No! Streaming, we're doing it, we're good. No. Oh. 
Good. Dose, can you please? Oh. Let me take this. Oh, damn it. I was gonna be dead. to do that achievement someday though someday just like all the rest of them i was really iffy if i'd ever get them out of here there's a lot of stuff going on there huh cool just killed your partner for no reason can kill people. What are you doing? Oh my gosh. Very grabby. Good job. Damn it. I'm still above, though. Oh, no, I'm dead. <laughs> that was close. Woo. Focused. I am high strung. My hamstrings have never been tighter. I have not stretched in 40 years. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Good luck, Toast. I'm dead. <laughs> Ugh. I'm gonna throw a bomb in like three seconds. <laughs> okay. Oh, I could try. Bring in the big band. Boom. Oh, he's puppy. Moment's done. Okay, thanks for playing, Moople. You've been lots of fun. We got to hug and be cute animals together so much. Is anyone in- oh, uh, I guess we can chat, uh. I was asking Toast if they want to play another. See if I can finish up my dailies. Before we move on to, uh, Fallout 3. I'll assume yes. Might have an egg coin or something, though. So I'm just going to give it a, a quick little sec here. 
Well, I forgot to mute. But I'm going to ready up. Okay, toast can go again. Sweet. She's sending Maple some hippos. As so thank you. Imagine being gifted uh, many hippos. Imagine what you could do with so many hippos. If you... Like, I'm not... Again, this is just a silly concept idea. Don't do this, anyone, in real life. I swear that this that you shouldn't do, shouldn't do this. I don't endorse behavior like this. But... Imagine how unstoppable you'd be with, like... Uh, let's say maybe maybe like six six hippos if you had six trained hippos like imagine I, I feel like six is the the smallest number it could be it could be like five I feel like you know someone could probably take that on but with six hippos you could like be unstoppable what could you do with that amount of power you could you could skip any line no one's gonna mess with six hippos it'll be the, the ultimate bodyguards like it they'll they'll make like like a uh a circle around you. No one's gonna mess with them. They'll be scared of them. They have other abilities that are deterrent. Um, that don't involve them like ramming things or them using their mouth. They they just have other ways of deterring people. I'll, I'll leave it at that. Um. I just think it'd be, you just you you wouldn't you wouldn't be able to. No one would be able to say no to you. What? <laughs> Meaning everyone would be able to, would have to say yes to you, like, like, hey, can I, can I take this book out? If you're in the, at the library, and then the librarian's like, no, you, you're, you can't. You have these horrible, horrible DVDs that are still out for for months. You haven't returned them yet, and then I'll say, no, I still need them. And then I'll I'll be like, but I also need these horrible, dirty horrible dvds and then if i have a group of six oh, hippos are they going to say no to that i don't think so i do not think so hippo thank you what if i had one <laughs> am i powerless well okay I'm, I'm going against like i'm talking about a general population here but with one for me you know I, that that would definitely catch my attention and and <laughs> sway me in most most situations. Like this is, I, I, this is also like for for the longest time I've had this idea that a political party the the next animal they should adopt as their symbol is the hippo, because that's an animal you just can't say like you can't disagree with that one. It'll be like oh you're adorable I want you for Christmas, or you'll be too intimidated because they're so big and huggable. But I, I feel like with with six of them, like, like if you called in the National Guard, you still would have a pretty good advantage. Like that, that's that's what I'm saying. That's why I was like prefacing this with like, no one try this if you have six hippos. If, if you had like maybe less than six, I don't. I feel like maybe you might get overpowered. In most situations, like even let's say like a mob of people, if you have six hippos, that's like two tanks worth of hippo there. Um, and also, government powers, don't employ hippos. I'm telling you not to. This would be a bad idea. But as a deterrent, <laughs> I feel like a few hippos would be very good. Like, like even bodyguards, normal bodyguards, wouldn't be able to put up with that. C could a SWAT team overpower a hippo with, with I'm saying here, non-lethal equipment? Could they overpower a hippo? I don't know. Don't, I do not know. I, I think six hippos versus a, a, a SWAT team. I think I know which one I'd be betting on. I feel like I could reenact this in totally accurate battleground. <laughs> they, but if they had hippos, that's the that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Should I be worried? <laughs> All I'm saying is there's a reason I put a hippo at the start of my. Of my all my streams, they're a symbol of power. <laughs> Damn, I've been getting really dunked on this round. 
They always go for me first. <laughs> Well, again, that's that's kind of why I prefaced it with like government powers or people who have hippos don't do this because look, I'm kind of just giving my time, giving myself time to amass six hippos. I feel like most people out there might have like two hippos at most. No audio. Thank you, Punk Chef. I'm glad to hear you're listening to the hippo talk at least. Also known as hippo talk on TikTok. I love hippos so much. <laughs> they they make me really happy. They're they're like the hugest pig. They're like if a pig was the biggest thing possible, and if it's like size was proportional to how strong I think it would be. I love their little ears that that like wiggle. I love that they they're like capybaras where they their anatomy their their skull anatomy is so that they can like chill in the water without having to get out of it because all their nostrils are way up high. <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> they got the big schnauzer. You're getting aggravated at Cod. Oh no. You need to, just, you need to step away. You need to... You're getting heated. You, you're, you're tilted. It's not going to help you in the long run. Damn, blue team dunked on us. I'm okay with that. Um, I prefer losing quickly instead of prolonging it and losing, I suppose. So, good work though, Toast. I know we did our best. Better off alone. I, I love that song. <laughs> oh, I need to find that one DV, that one CD that I I've told you about Maple that had that had like a ton of techno burn to it. That's all like early two thousands techno that I grew up with. It was it's a it's a very special CD. Cotton Eye Joe is on there. Crazy Frog is on there. Every Time We Touch is on there. I had... I remember... Okay, so I have a... Uh, I had this uh, MP4 player for the longest time. It was called a Walkman because it was by Sony. But it wasn't actually a Walkman, of course, because it was an MP3, MP4 player. Um, But either on that... I'm pretty sure on that. On God. I have, um, I'm pretty sure that CD is on that, but also, I remember as a really young kid, I had the original iPod Shuffle, the, the little stick one that had a USB butt that you could, like, you could take off the little uh, cap and it would just be a USB stick that you could load your songs onto. I'm pretty sure that CD that I'm talking about had that on it. Pretty sure that CD, I had that CD on that shuffle. I loved that thing, man. It could, it could hold up to like 120 songs, maybe 100. I, I think I had the, maybe the gigabyte version, but I know for a fact they had a version that was 512 megabytes. And they advertised that you could store 120 songs on it, roughly. I mean, the quality of songs back then, I, I, I imagine. I imagine you can fit 120 on there easily. So sorry if you heard that quack. I don't know why my, my mouth made that noise. I think I'm turning into a duck. Oh, I don't know if it was obvious. I'm dead. Okay, I was doing that, putting that there near you to, like, defend you. This wasn't that helpful. Oh, yeah, the dog is in the game now. This, this cute, uh... German Shepherd. The German Shepherd was one of my favorite dogs for a long time. I really like Bull Terriers, and I think... I think Rotties are very cute, too. I think they have very baby face type animal. 
And then I, I think I liked German Shepherds because of, like, maybe dog meat from Fallout 3. And Fallout New Vegas was the, uh, had Rex, who I think was also a German Shepherd. I might be wrong about those two, but I know the most recent dog meat from Fallout 4. I know he's a, a Joyman Yepard. You're, you're killing it, Toast. Oh, shit. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I got so dramatic by the end. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I'm thinking of Teen Girl Squad. Aww. Oh my god, that killed me really quick. I have not been keeping up with Strong Bad over the years. I think I've, it's been like maybe four or five years since I looked at Strong Bad content. I really liked Strong Bad as a kid. I thought it was really cute and fun. Cast of characters. I was uh, into it back in the early, in the in the 2000s, which I've I've noticed is a very silly concept at the moment. When I hear two th like I hear I hear like YouTubers and reviewers saying like the the early 2000s or the late 2000s, and I think that's gonna take a very different context in the year. Well, I mean, okay, but <sighs> I'm being silly. I'm being very silly to think this. So I'll just I'll just reprogram my brain to just fully understand it. But it's like. It's like saying the early 1900s, you know, or the the early ni yeah, I guess 1900s. Saying like the early 2000s would make me think, oh. So, or, or I guess saying the late 2000s would make me think, oh, in the year like 2000, like 8012 or 8012, <laughs> 82, something like that. We consider that the late 2000s. But I, I mean, we're living in the current time, so saying. Saying the late 2000s should make sense now. Where was I going with this? Why was I mentioning it? Oh, yeah. In the late 2000s, uh... Oh, hi. Um... Tall Tale Games released a five-part episodic series, like, like all the games they release, for, uh, Strong Bad. Strong Bad had a game. I thought that was really fun. And I had it on the Wii. Like, they, they released that on the Wii shop. I bought all five parts while they were coming out on the Wii. It was glorious. I was like... I was like... I guess... I wouldn't say during the heyday of Strong Bad either when they released those games. Like, I know he was also in, like, Night at the Inventory or whatever, but... I don't think, um... I think, like, the peak of Strong Bag was probably earlier than that, because that's when the site was, like, very well enjoyed, I think. Like, prior to the, the games releasing, instead of during the games releasing time period. What happened? Oh. I didn't even notice that Yellow Team won twice. Nice try. Oh. Whoa. That sucks. Oh, spamming the buttons. Damn. Damn. I was trying to aim the fish at them. Good try. I still remember the title of the game, though. I think I remember the acronym. SBCG4AP. Strong Bad... <clears throat> Strong Bad's cool game for attractive people. SBCG4AP. <laughs> I also know the content was, like, on Homestar Runner. That was the website of one of the characters. 
But I wouldn't do it for strong bad. You know it for strong bad. Like, I can't right now. Something's wrong with my mouth. There's just, there's just too much stuff in my mouth right now. There's like five tongues. I got the mod. A few tongue modders out there. Okay, I tried hacking up a hairball. I always think I'll get lucky with those fish throws. And <laughs> they picked it up, fucker. No! No! Toast, why? No! Oh. The audience goes, aww. The Smash Bros. audience, aww. You know, this game is kind of like Smash Brothers, if you th really think about it. It's like if Smash Brothers had Call to the Lamb and Ori and cut the rope. And T-Pain, my favorite Smash Brother. T-Pain, one of the Mario Brothers. Whoa. Oh, come on. So unfair. I was just intently watching to see who would, who would usurp. Okay. Okay. Nice. So you're all fired up. Feeling the Christmas spirit? No. No. That's where I'm climbing. There. No. No. Oh god, this is bad. Come on. Okay. Good god. Knock them out. Make sure they're dead. <laughs> okay, I'm pretty sure that's dead. <laughs> nice. What? <laughs> A lot of objects there to get stuck on. Okay. And I'm dead. It's either red or yellow to win it. I still see a guy with the red having a nunchuck. Oh my god. Whoa! Oh, sorry to yell, but whoa. Oh my gosh, toast. Woo! Nice work. Nose ring is clanging. We might as well shoot around, see if it does anything. It's not doing too much, this guy.
Trying to fight each other. Me and the hammer guy. They both have things that don't knock people out. This push people. Oh, well, I spoke too soon, I guess. Spin me right round. You're right about that. Punk chef. You really punked me there. Oh. You spin me right round, baby. Like a record. Oh. I wonder if that song's known for anything. I'm sorry. There. Revenge. Oh. No. Got his ass. Oh, I tried grabbing you. Good work. I might win this. Goodbye. Could be two people. Life could be a dream. That's one person at least. Life could be a cream. Life could be a ream. Whoa. <laughs> Got 3D for a sec there. Good strat. Oh, not good. Damn, it's gonna knock me out. Damn it. Thank you. You really saved my bacon. Really greased my pan. Wow. Good job. Woo. <laughs> Wow. Really underdogged it. Underdogged, more like undercat. <laughs> you start paying attention and I- yeah. It was all you, punk chef. It was the- um, I wasn't gonna say meat spin. It was the reference you made. <laughs> that, that, that really encouraged me. I swear, I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> Mmm. Das cookie. I think that's it for me. I usually just do my dailies and then I get on with the show. Know what I mean? I mean, come on. I mean, fall guy, I mean, party animals being the main event. Are you kidding me? But thanks for playing, Toast. The game has gotten a little stale. But I do enjoy playing it with friends. And mooms. Okay, so we're at a crossroads here. Do we play Fallout or Fortnite or RuneScape? Trick question. We're already playing Fallout. I'm sorry. I, I really want to just punk you. Much is your name, chef. Oh, grinding for camos. I know that's a thing you do in, in Cod of Duty. It's like saying ATM machine. Cod, Cod of Duty. He said duty. Oh, my controller's on my thigh. Uh-uh. Can't be having that now. Nope. Okay. Uh, play, play back up, because, you know, uh, eventually I'm going to put this uh, in, a, in an episode. Do you say pie? Uh, I don't think I said pie. I might have said pie. 
everyone, back it up. Check the records. Did I say pie? Anyways, hello. Hi, everyone. Pie, everyone. It's another Fallout. I want pie, says Punk Chef. Well, I hope you can find yourself some pie. Maybe go to a uh, Burger King and get yourself a Hershey pie. I, I heard recently that those Hershey pies are just like a different type of pie that you can get at a grocery store or something. Or something like that. I forgot what, but... I, I do enjoy those Hershey pies they have at Burger King. They're tasty. Rumors go oh, <laughs> hi, Dripples. I'm sure you see me uh, on the friends list every so often in RuneScape. I'll play RuneScape on stream again, actually. You make those pies from scratch, Punk Chef? That's amazing. Oh, wow. I'm really low on weight right now. We're actually right. It's me. I set myself up at the start of every, at the end of every stream to be ready for the next one. Always hanging out in here. Wow. I'm really growing my collection. Speaking of which, that's how we're going to start off the stream. We're going to clear this out. We're going to do some home interior decorating. We're going to do some posterior decorating. Oh. 14 teddy bears. I got... I got shell-shocked. Like TMNT shell-shocked. Seeing all those. Teddy bears. Oh my god, it's a huge one. Holy moly. Oh my goodness. I'm keeping- you need to go somewhere special. Oh, You need to go somewhere special, mister. I want your other big brother. Wow. Um, they're friends. Okay. Anyway. Should I eat some Reese's Puffs? Well, if you want peanut butter chocolate flavor, you should partake. Uh-oh. I hope things are going well with you today, sir. I think I damaged Wadsworth with that. And myself. There's some blood on my screen. There still is. Oh, fuck me. Dude's name Wadworth. Oh, oh, hi, blood. Dude's name Wadworth. Imagine. Imagine being named Wadworth. Oh, fuck, I picked up a teddy bear. No, I did it again. I don't want to pick them up. I want to drop them. Oh, these are getting, like, phased. You're getting like Star Trek phased. Oh, ho, 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 it's a teddy bear picnic. Welcome home, sir. Hi. Fuck. You aren't leaves. Stop dropping the rake. Wow, wow. Skrillex, drop the rake. That's better. That's better. How many? I can't wait until I play... <clears throat> can't wait until I play, uh... New Vegas so I can trade up this sickly green for piss yellow <laughs> interfaces. I know you can edit the interface to look like either game if you really wanted to. Which is pretty... Good customization, that you can change the color of this Welcome stuff. Home, wow. It's pulsing! <laughs> it's, it undulates. Mm. You guys know the coin pusher game? <laughs> it grows. It, it, it beats. It's like a, a cave slime. A D and D dungeon slime. Welcome home. A jelly cube. Sir? Right? I mean, I, I'm cool. I know D and D. It's just like that. <laughs> this is awesome. I'm gonna try Welcome making home, it more sir. stable if I can. Okay. 
I think I've helped. I think it stopped undulating. Okay, cool. These tendrils. Okay. Good. We're in the money. We got a lot of what makes... I don't know, I forgot how the song goes. We got a lot of what makes the world go round. I forgot what the lyrics of We're in the Money are. Someone out there knows it by heart. What did I drop? A rake. Okay. Car. Truck. 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 I wish you could tell more easily where the thing is going to spawn. Oh, good, he moved, finally. I need to, like, close off that room so he doesn't go in it. Always makes it feel way more claustrophobic when he's in there. I wish I could drop the virus on the floor. Yeah. That looks good. That's a playthrough's worth of Nuka-Cola trucks right there. Rake, wood chipper. I think there's a Brahmin skull in here. It's good to oh, there's tons of these that aren't there. Yeah. Oh God. Well, sir. Well, sir. Well, sir. Saya. <laughs> you be able to put the FEV. In the Nuka Cola fridge and get an ice cold FEV. Awesome. I mean, if they knew it was what I if the, if they play tested this game, they would have known that. Every player would have wanted that. That's Bethesda, you know. You've seen Starfield? Yeah. They made this one first. Think they play tested this one more or less than Starfield? I'll let you I'll let you answer that one. My god. Oh my god. Woo! I just wanted to see what would happen. Gonna have to pick up half of them. Okay. This is good. Yeah, by the way, we have the full collection of uh, bobbleheads now. Speaking of decor. We're making it more stable the more they're phased into each other, right? <laughs> yes. Okay. Cool. <laughs> My god. Okay, then there's the damaged ones. I can fix her. I know she's damaged, but I can fix her. Well, I know he's damaged because he has it written on his forehead. And he's part of the... Suicide Squad? I don't, I don't think the Joker's part of the squad, actually. I think he's just there. What are we, some, side of, some kind of Suicide Squad? Okay. It appears you've been wounded, sir. May I suggest you... I feel like me dropping the rake wounded me. Good. It's looking good. It's correct. It's their house now. The gnomes are taking over your house. It's true. There's, there will soon be more gnome than house. Good. And then I'm arming them with all these rakes. Okay, it's not where I want to. They kind of always spawn behind me. Okay, first, let's quick save to be safe. Ah! It grows, Maple. So many gnomes. Riku, hello. They say Riku? Niner, Niner, Riku, Niner. Oh. Sure. Look, either way, these are going to be a, a Toontown gag, regardless of where I put them. Be a Toontown ga trap gag. 
Okay, I'll play two in town. If you really want me to, folks, I'll play two in town next stream. Is that what you want? <laughs> yes, says Maple. <laughs> yes, says Riku. Two in town or riot. <laughs> It's either RuneScape or Toontown, and I know which one the audience wants. <laughs> I know what my audience is. Which one should I play, though? Should I play re Rewritten or Corporate Clash? I, it's, I forgot what the other one is called. Children yearn for mines, Squint. <laughs> oh, no. Yearn for the mines. Corporate Clash, because you'd solo low leveling. You'd be able to... Oh, you'd be solo low level. That's true. You're saying I'd be solo, low level in, uh, in Rewritten, right? Because Rewritten, the only people who play it are... Toontown R is long to- yeah. Yeah, uh-huh. Everyone who plays Rewritten is just, like, max level, just idling in Donald's Dreamland. Corporate Clash is pretty based, though. I mean, I, I like the features in that one. You can, you can, like, transmog your character. You can trans your character <laughs> whenever you want. Then you can like change your uh, species on the fly. Ooh. Corporate Clash is good amount. Yeah, it has some clever ideas. But you're in for stickers. Why do the children you're in for stickers? In what game? In real life? I mean, fair enough. I like stickers. Good to see you alive Most well. furries like stickers. There's, like, a lot of furries support themselves on the st sale of stickers. But yes, we will, uh... I'd be down to play Corporate Clash. That'd be fun. I think that'd be a fun stream. Me playing Fallout 3. Let's play something else that's not this. Come on. There. It's better, I guess. Sure. But no! <laughs> oh, that's perfect. Ooh. I yearn for that. I yearn for a big booty cow sticker. I'd love to have emotes on my streams, but I have to be a big-time YouTuber to be, have access to that. I don't mean big-time YouTuber, I mean I need 500 subs and... And a lot of hours viewed. They require... Okay, this was... <laughs> I fucked everything up. They require you to, um... You have to have 3,000 watched hours on all your videos or, like, live streams total. But also, if you have a, uh, if you have a YouTube short that, like, really pops off, that also can count as a separate pool of views, but not the same pool of views. So, it's like you either have a, a you're either a really good shorts channel or you're really good at videos. And 500 subs. That's good. Saving that. Burrito. The burrito permission. Maple does wear many stickers. It's true. I like how she looks in a sticker. He's basically watching me play like House Flipper, right? It's like House Flipper plus uh, Search and Simulator. <laughs> I should uh. I've seen this one YouTube channel who, like, tries emulating being, like, really, really early YouTube. Like, they post a ton of videos in the style of, like, early YouTube. Uh, where the people who are posting videos in the style of, like, specifically, like, 2010s YouTube Let's Plays. I need to start playing, like, Surgeon Simulator and Amnesia the Dark Descent and Happy Wheels. <laughs> I think there's a big market for that. Time is cyclical, and we're getting bored. We need we need to return back to our roots. 
Next upload of mine will be a, a YTP. Come on. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> okay, you can just chill in the corner. There. Nice. <laughs> it's like an Animal Crossing house where you put down its cow skull. Hippo. Ooh, bootleg maple stickers. Mix of... <laughs> Make six of these, protect your house. Aw. Make ten of these, rob a bank. No, the cat, the hippos. That's what I was warning against. I think you could rob a bank if you had six hippos. <laughs> okay. I'm sipping my bevies. Good job, punk chef. Oh, it's the eight balls. Moo heart. Ah, oh, the eight balls. <laughs> My collection of eight balls are like deep in there. See those two? Um, I don't think I'm getting to those anytime soon. So I'm just gonna, just gonna empty these randomly in in the pile of gnomes. They'll they'll work their way down. I'm sure. I'm invisible. Okay. Okay, that didn't that wasn't as pachinko as I or uh plinko as I thought it would be. Oh that there we go. This pachinko works too. Nice. Okay, they were added. They're protected now. Save the throwing grenade, sure. I think I have a throwing grenade though. Oh wait, yeah I do. I have some some in the locker. What if that breaks my game? <laughs> if we're, if, while we're at it. <laughs> oh, the teddy bear found its way here. <laughs> How'd the teddy bear get down here? I was about out the farthest away. That didn't kill me. Did it radiate things? Myth busted. Oh no! Oh my goodness! Oh no! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> wow, <laughs> this is modern art. <laughs> I didn't even know they can get stuck in there. Look at the Silent Hill. It's so Silent Hill. It's all rusty and and everything's phased through. <laughs> oh, I'm still alive somehow. Oh my god, it keeps happening. How am I not dead? <laughs> Ghosts. It's oh no. Oh no. What the fuck? <laughs> Why? Thank well, God. Sir. I was worried. <laughs> that also, that's really funny of him to say. Good to see you alive and well. After all that. Yeah, let's get a... Let's get a grenade. Have these weird ones that aren't full condition. Cool. That's Gamebryo for you. That's that's not Havoc though. Whoa. Oh, it happened in here again. You, Whoa. You Goodbye. Very cool. I <laughs> need to make sure I load on a save that isn't glitched out. Okay. So glad that just goes back to normal. Be very inconvenient if it wasn't like that. 
Oh, I, I learned that this is only useful for that one station. It won't protect you from other uh, turrets. So I might as well put this away. It also respawns on the Enclave that are there. So you can get like an indefinite, an indefinite amount of those cards that protect you from the turrets at that one station. Okay. I wonder what we want to do this episode. Sounds like a lucrative business. I did go to Minefield, I think, already. I think I got everything I wanted to from there. Okay. Oops. Save here. Okay, I'm gonna do my classic tab opening. Squint's going in his tabs. looking through things that I might want to do. I delete a tab by accident just now. No. My most recent tab that I deleted was RuneScape related. Woundscape. Hmm. I think I've been here before. But it's worth trying it out. Uh I actually opened up a bunch of tabs for a bunch of, like, unmarked locations that I want to check out, just in case I didn't. Northeast, south of Greyditch, and directly west of the Falls Church Metro. Trying to pinpoint it. It's like right here. Okay. There's a neat location that's just known as the sewer. Aw, I cut a clip for you. Thanks. Thanks, Daps. Also, thank you for the confetti. Wow. We see that tab. Oh no. I hope you didn't see all that that porn. Can you? Could you actually? Oh, you could. Oops. I'm sorry that you probably you did see that. Why is that captured? Sorry, did you see porn? I'm sure you saw porn. Why is that being captured? Discord? No, no porn, no fair. Okay, what what is? Oh, this is Saints. Okay. No, I don't think I did. Okay, you did see me like retweet my stuff though. But okay. I'm glad that I've uh, figured that out. Okay, we're in Viso Bill. Okay, directly west from here isn't that convenient, actually. Let's go, uh... Let's reload this, actually. Actually. Let's go here. All these places are way done with their three-day timers. Because I've already swept through them a long time ago. Ack. Chili. Oh, I was going the wrong way. Whatever, fuck it. These guys are weak. Perfect aim. Like above me. Okay. 
free finger. Hey, we collect those. We need that if we want to get all those perks. Maple can feed a family of raccoon of one? What? It's true, Maple can feed me. And I do like eating her food. It makes me very happy. Aw. Well, soon she'll be feeding a raccoon family of many. If I have my way. and it'll be funded off of these caps <laughs> that I'm collecting. This is an honest day's work right here. Killing raiders for bottle caps. It's basically what Fred, Fred Flintstone did in the in the Jetsons, right? And fingers. Fred, Flint Fred Flintstone's from the Jetsons, right? I, th I think. He's from the Flitsons. Sure. He was from the F Jetsons because they, in the future, thawed out a caveman in a block of ice, and it was... It, it was him. Also, this is an unmarked location over here. Uh-oh. Oh, it's too late. I'm leaving. How am I with my unarmed? Nice. Okay, we're still... We're still having fun. What the fuck is going on? They attacking raiders? Can't tell. They're probably t attacking the Brotherhood. The uh, excuse me, the outcasts. Oh, cool! They're going right toward me. Cool. Oh. <laughs> Thank you for being vague about that. Punk Chef mentioned that they watched a show where the main character died. My leg! <laughs> That's really good. <laughs> it was very my leg. <laughs> the way that guy ragdolled. Oh, brother! <laughs> this guy stinks! Are you still there? I know where Portal got it from. <laughs> this is ridiculous. I love this part of the game. When you're this late level. Hi, Robots. Never stood a chance. This evil eye droid. What happens if we deactivate him? He's just stand still. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that makes sense. When you turn them off, they just stand there. I always explode. I was hoping that one would just fall to the ground so I could, like, search it. So I could, like, totally search it. And stuff. Nice. I'm liberating... Liberating all these supplies. Honest day's work. I'm pretty sure this is one of the locations that are my tabs, but not where I was intentionally going, so... Lucky us. This is just called, like, the auto garage, or car dealership, yes. Oh. Oh, thank god. I thought it broke. Okay, so yeah, I think I was here before.
Looks like my doing, yeah. Uh... Sorry, this never happens. It's like directing me up here? No? Okay. Very fun, Bethesda. I like when you put that in your game. We don't put extra goodies. I love it. I go out of my way to look into a corner and you don't put an extra goodie. How's a raccoon supposed to get by like this. Yeah, I think I've already been here. I collected that one cup, though. Oh. Oh, a scavenger died. No. That's who they were killing. I think I'm getting farther away from the location. Yeah. Just trying to look if there's the body of the scavenger. Don't see it. Oh, there's a Brahmin. Well, we'll just take its goods and then resurrect it, of course. Can't let that happen. Oh, it had a, uh... It had a Nuka-Cola truck for me. Okay. Spelled that wrong. Yes. She's back. Resuscitated cow. I'll kill this guy. Make sure she's safe. Goodbye. <laughs> Arms open. Wide. Oh, brother. I'm still not there yet. I thought I was going the wrong way for a sec, but no, now I think I see where it could be. I think I do remember going to this sewer thing in a previous playthrough. Oh, who's this then? What's all this? Uh oh. Are there gunshots? No? Okay. Look at this. A little scavenger. Need? What have we got? Flamer, okay. Let's take his take their book. Wow. Wow, they had three skill books. This place is overpowered. Huh? <laughs> oh my gosh, sure. These parts aren't that common. You can have your gnome. Sign of respect. There it is. I think it just has ghouls. Ghouls, I say ghouls. Aw, oh, Riku getting EP. It's also a gas leak in here. They're getting EP due to gas leak. Because that's not a good thing. Oh, you're all cozy. That's much better. <laughs> EP, cause of, cause of death. EP due to gas leak. Oh god, that was bad. Uh, disarm! Yes! It worked! The mid-air disarm. Risky, but when you pull it off, you feel like you're the king of the world. 
release King of the Raccoons. Wow. Let's see this happen. Oh. Close. A critical hit on it. Oh. We had enough. Okay, those guys are very annoying to deal with, so... Oh, hi, two. Oh, no, there was just one. It was just the effect of the gas. I can blame it on the gas. On the gak 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 gas <laughs> That boing sound. Boing. I do like cartoon boing sounds. The smelly gas. This raccoon is gassy. <laughs> True. Gas and up a storm. Uh oh. They saw me. Or not. I did not expect that one punch to reach. Oh, wow, more. Is that they keep getting revived? Not actually, though. I don't think so. I don't think so. Not so fast. Um, I don't think so. Okay, here we go. Oh, I think I touched it on accident. Damn it. Well, at least I got a few hits on it. There. Not too much in here. I think the only thing they guaranteed that was in here was that rocket launcher spawn. We picked up a rocket launcher and an easy chest at the end of it. Okay, cool. Saving and checking things off. Sewer. This is a place called Shelter. It's a talent company camp. There's an abandoned tent in the middle of nowhere. Car dealership. Yep. Went there, did that. There's an area around uh, shelter or fallout, or like, uh, an area around fall, uh, vault 106. That's called the patriotic picnic area. Why'd you punch him in the butt? <laughs> you think you know where the abandoned tent is? Nice. Excuse me. I think I might have visited the musty caverns, but. If not, that's a place we can go. Hilltop farm ruins. The ghoul outpost. Overlook raider shack. I think I went there already. Two. Then there's actually marked locations I haven't been to. Let's go to shelter. I want to see what that's like. Okay. Can be kind of hard to pin down. Oh, that's why we save. The shelter location is like under a bridge. It's like north of the Anchorage Memorial. Way north. Like way north. Oh my god, hello. Well, um. Okay, then. Fuck. Hope this one didn't see me. I love the knockback. It's very goofy looking. Oh, 
Okay, you're gone. Bye. Interesting. You, like, floated in there. Yes, human flesh. This stuff's rare. That's a reason to want it, because it's rare. Okay. Damn it, I should only fast travel from crouched. Okay. Because I know I won't be uh, detected if I am. I believe I didn't put FOV 90 first. TC alt before FOV 90. Look at this stuff. Wow. Okay, here bombs. What the fuck is happening? Okay, a lot's happening in front of me somewhere. Ow. Oh. Mutants. Goodbye. I'm having fun just w w w keying into things. Talent company, I think. Yep. I think I found the shelter. It's right under there. Keep trying to zoom with that function. Oh, you're a vertebrate. Hi. Oh, it landed. Ooh. Interesting. Even with your insane unarmed skill, they take a lot of damage. They do. The overlords always take so much. Oh. Oh my. See these pencils? Wow. Oh shit. Things are getting fucked up because I crouched while going TCL. TCL, please cooperate. I just want to look at this stuff. <laughs> cool, I didn't even know there's the under pencils too. Mm, very good. Oh my. Oh yeah, I remember reading this location has tons of plungers. I think there's like 80 plungers or maybe 40. Oh, hi. Goodbye. Cool. Finding stuff like this was always neat before they just put, like, Skull and Teddy Bear in every toilet in Fallout 4, I bet. I definitely was not as attached to Fallout 4. So I have yet to learn of all the basic, like, oh, haha, it's a teddy bear. But no, they, they really went, really made it special here. Hi. <laughs> Take you with me. Really made it special in Fallout 3 and in New Vegas. Oh yeah, again, remember, fun fact, you can actually check these bags. Very rare that you come across them, but you can check these to get blood packs. The IV stands.
our plungers, plunger. Mentats, nice. <laughs> cool. Whoa. <laughs> oh my gosh, keeps going. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the effort to precisely place everything just for it to fall apart. It's like you look at it. Yeah. <laughs> that is a weird quirk of this engine, how everything just falls down the moment you like interact with a part of it. I don't care, I'm just gonna do this. I can platform my way up here. And the vertebrate's gone. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, I'm almost full. Goodbye. <laughs> For the president! <laughs> Rip. Oh, hi. That's what they were going after, the centaur. I guess that would distract me, too. Oh, I didn't really, like, drag up, drag their back part along. Neat. Never noticed the last two arms aren't really doing much. Is there, like, a captive here to save? A, a damsel? A Brahmin in distress. I need to save the Brahmin. Oh, another Verda? Okay. They needed reinforcements, clearly. Dead. No big surprise. I didn't find this, uh... This mutant camp on that list of uh, unmarked locations for some reason. So I'm glad I found it and getting to check it out. No, not much here. Not, namaste. <laughs> there we go. I would never be able to stop you. Nope, not once. This just instantly kills me. It's back here. Is there anything back here? Well, some stairs. MLG platforming. MLG quick saving. I was looking on the Wikipedia a while ago, and I saw, um... Oh, it's captive! I saw that this game, they originally... Very late in development. So they originally had, like, the main DC area being, like, the main part of the map. Like, let's say... Uh, I mean, like, definitely this downtown part, but I think, like, it cuts off maybe... Near the Temple of the Union, there's like a slice here, and then it, it goes like down kind of where the vault is. So there's like a big L, this big strip along this edge, and then this edge that was like not originally in the game. Like all these locations that are like more on the outskirts, they were added very late into development if you look up the like the map on the Fallout Wikipedia. Just talk about it and uh. I think during a game developer conference, they they, oh my God. they discussed what it was like having to add that much to the game. Oh yeah, they screwed up the whole downtown DC area. They they really did, yeah. There's also that aspect where the DC area was going to be even bigger. But they, uh, they decided to scale it down heavily. 
which I don't mind. I don't like the metro systems too much, but outside of that, the rest of the DC stuff is pretty fun. Like the, the main, the mall is a good area. No, you'll need more than I do. There's nothing she can give me that would really help. Okay, cool. So the shelter was another location. Just going on our little adventure, exploring different places, like this is VR chat or something. There's an easy one I haven't been to. I think I might go to that one next. Sure. There's there's two like camps I haven't gone to. Let's go to those. One of them is known as the like just a mutant camp over here. It's the one that's close to Rivet City. Just never explored it. Hi. Uh, let's... Let's wait till it's daylight. Oh no, my well rested. Whatever will I do without my well rested? Ah. Uh, the metro is supposed to make more sense with the old map. I can... Yeah. Trading I bet. Looking for that special... Hi. Crazy wolf oh, great. got just what you need. Assuming you need the random junk. At least you're the best repairman. Oh boy. Yep, we're doing it. Cool. A ton of this stuff I don't want. I mean, you'll just be out here polluting Rivet City for the rest of the time. The stuff I'm tossing on the ground. It's fine. No one, no one cares. It's outside Rivet City. It doesn't matter. People would care if it was inside. Yeah, let's put these mutilated organs and legs down here, out here too. No one will mind. That's charm, right? Look where you're going. Hey, hey, looking. Just in case the Brahmin get hungry. Gangs got just what you need. Assuming you need the random junk that I. Oh my god, twenty-five now. I was struggling to get like two of them in my house. Now I have 25 land uh, grenades just at the ready. That'll be fun. Put those to good use inside my house again. And cool. Save. Let's go. Shave. Save. Oh, hi. Okay, so this is a noteworthy unmarked location. Hmm. 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 Uh oh, why'd I do that? The Enclave is here. So are these guys. Not for long. Not forlorn. Imposter syndrome. Being a streamer, am I right? When the imposter is sus syndrome. Offering the legs, I'll just take the caps. Yerma. Yoima. 
Is Yerma streaming? I know. I I checked his uh Oh, because the imposter is sus, got it. But um I did use command sus in his chat the other Oh I I didn't mean to force the lock, but it worked out. Uh, for, the, for like the past month, his command sus is talking about how he, he plans for his next stream to really be the macaroni tasting stream. Because he's been teasing it for the past like two streams, which is which means the past two months in, in Germa terms now that he's retired. But he plans to just cook up like a ton of different types of uh, mac and cheese brands and then try them all. Uh, my throat today. Fuck. There we go. Fuck my throat today. Can't take that out of context. It's working. Coming more than human. Nice. Yep, hello again. Saw you earlier. What? How'd you get captured again? Who? I know it's a different I person. Mean, are you for real? I'm safe? I, I am for I real. Here. here, take these supplies. It's all I have, but they'll only slow me down. Hmm. No, you'll need them more than I will. Okay, if you say so. I can't thank you enough, stranger. I'm such a good guy. Good luck out there. I'm sorry, Miss Captive. <laughs> As compared to Miss Marvel. <coughs> oh, I'm dying. Sorry for coughing directly into the mic. I'll get better, though. Okay, bonfire. Oh, it's called the Superman Bonfire. It's that location's name. Okay, and then I know another camp, li camp light... Rogue light location. Oh. Hello. Goodbye. <laughs> cool. I'll take your Meyer Lurk meat. Thought this rock was one. It's so weird to see any working vehicle in Fallout game. Oh, hi. Okay, we're doing this. Poor guy went in with the, uh, combat knife. Again, always tragic to see when that happens. Keep away. Should have played keep away. It's a from raccoon. Ow. No, we're just short. So short. Please. There. There we go. Saving really quick to minimize something. To minimize my tabs. Never mind how one of those Metro trams are still running. Yeah, in the destroyed Met in the destroyed underground for the. For that one, uh, steel, broken steel quest stuff. Sewer. I think this is a broken steel sewer, but this is one of the places I wanted to go to. Oh, maybe it's, uh... Oh, no, it's Raider. I thought it was gonna be, uh, Talon Company. How I got ambushed by Talon Company and all. Oh. Giving him the run around. Giving him the reach around. Critical reach around. Could have sworn I was walking over a trip mine. 
Ooh, dynamic dialogue. Oh, that's all I had to say. Nice. My switchblade. I think there's someone above me. Yeah. Or be hello. Now it seems above. Fuck. Not even looking what's in them. It's like, oh, there's stuff in here? I'll take it. That's a good uh, mod I've seen for this game. The mod that makes it like a uh, Fallout 4 inventory uh, containers. I can just like see outside the container what's inside of it. That's a good, uh, uh, a good little quality of life addition. Hmm. Mod that removes green from everything. <laughs> that's the that's the game. Fallout Three and Fallout New Vegas. It's either <laughs> green or yellow. I was commenting about the UI and the in the Pip Boy. Oh hi bye. How the how the UI in both in either game is like either really green or really yellow. Same goes for the game itself. Like the whole time. Green ass filter ass. Oh, please. Please just tear me up. Go time. Oh. Sorry about that. It was, in fact, go time. For one of us. The liberals. <laughs> the green is sickening in Fallout New in Fallout 3, yeah. Not as much as the yellow in Fallout New Vegas. I mean, the yellow kind of makes sense. You're looking at the desert the whole time, so... So you kind of expect to see yellow everywhere. It's sand. Oh. It's like nothing in real life looks this green. Metal armor. No thank you. Who in this game would wear metal armor? Makes no sense. And power it too? Why would you power metal armor? N n makes no one, it'll never catch on. Oh, I didn't mean to drop that. I thought I picked up, oh, there it is. There we go. You can stay in there. Aw, oh, now the raccoons roaming around looking for cows. So true. I sure do. This raccoon found a cow. As it should be. Hmm. Okay, I think that was it. Don't think there's anything else except this neat little raider business. It's a little one-way dungeon. Or, uh... You know what I mean. You, you played Skyrim. You've been in caves before that only have one exit and one entrance. It's like that, but in the wasteland. You played Skyrim, right? Right? <laughs> Wait, you're gonna tell me you haven't played Skyrim? <laughs> the fuck? 
Oh, bye. Okay. <laughs> Goodbye. It's fine with me. Make quick save. Wow, they're really tearing this shit up. Goodbye. No. Stuff got thrown around. <laughs> Still makes cue ball noises. I love that. Oh. Not that I wasn't expecting it to make cue ball noises. I'm just glad it did. Let me throw it around. Oh. Hello. Cue balls got thrown everywhere. My pool balls, not my pool balls. Wow. Ten missiles. Turn you off. Turn you on. Lit. Ball peen. Oh, wow. Got lucky. Less to deal with. We turn off the turrets, as we did. Oh, rip! Goodbye. Still stealthing around, having a good time, having a good time. Snipper this. Snipper these cliffs. By the way, you know how you saw my, like, my window being captured for a little bit. That's so weird, because that's supposed to be like the Discord capture for when me and Saint are playing Disco Elysium. It's supposed to be the Discord capture for when I'm capturing their avatar, their little uh their little goat. And of course OBS thought, hey let's uh let's capture that instead. Cause of course it would. Of course it would. Hello. One hit. One critical hit to the head. Oh, that's where we are. Oh, yeah. Cool. Let's see what's over here. Okay, nothing else. Oh, maybe. Hold on. See a landmine. I meant over there. Oh, there's two. What's all this then? Nope. Oh. Just nothing. You can't go this way. Nope. Sorry. We modeled it, but you can't go it. 
Okay. I see. Checking the thing. Make sure I close all the porn next time. And when I mean that, I mean I need to close my dis my Twitter account. That was that was what was being shown before when I'm, that I was iffy on. And it was uh showing the Twitter, the good old tweets. It's kind of like named locations that are on this list. I'm like, like, four hundred percent sure I've went to the Overlook Raider Shack, but that's. Mm, I'm gonna go to the abandoned, the abandoned tent first. Trying to map it up, or match it up on the map. Uh, Raven Rot, Raven, yep, Rivendell. Right here. I also want to check this place out again. Oh, I know what this is. This reservoir place, I remember now. What's going on over here? Who's this? Oh, it's the Yaogwai. Don't want to deal with them, really. I see it right there. Wait, so now they're annoy they're they're cone of annoyance. There's something attacking someone. Oh. Oh my god. There's the Yaogwai versus a Rad Scorp versus a Death Claw. Is there a third thing over there? A fourth thing? Looks like it. Oh, it's, it's one of those bloat flies going in for the kill. Yep. Wow. I'm really kind of curious what's going on with this this tub out there. Oh, so hello, Deathclaw. Oh, only one health. Poor thing. Oh, it's running away. No. Okay, that did no damage somehow. There. Sorry, Deathclaw appreciators. People of class and taste. this bathtub doing? Nothing? Okay. What is attacking me? Oh my god. I'm running. I don't want to deal with it. Deal with it when I have, when I have Fortnite cover. Cow skulls. do here um plasma rifle whatever okay 
We're doing it. Oh my god, hello. They snuck up on me. Little bastard. Wait. Let me search you. Yeah, but they blew away the cow skulls. Never forgive you for that. Actually, fuck this. I'm mad. This is personal. They messed with the cow skulls. Wow, that went through my legs, I guess. Yeah, come on, come at me. Who's next? Yeah, no thanks. Did nothing. Better luck next time. See another guy. Mr. Handy, or Mr. Gusty from before. It's okay, I'll just hide. He'll never find me. There. Safe and sound. <clears throat> Safe and sound. Oh, my throat. Hello. Fuck. But I almost had it. That's right. They almost did, actually. You're not wrong. Quantum. Okay, sweet. Nice little abandoned tent. Not, not too much to write home about. Still in caution mode. Okay. The winds are the gustiest. The birds are the bustiest. The gr gals are the dumpiest. I love that song. The germas are the dumpiest. Okay, there's this random thing called the abandoned camp. It's near the super duper mart, actually. The location that you explore, like, in the first minute of the game. just on this bridge. I'm gonna tear you apart. Oh. These are hey, good guys. The hell do you want? We're busy. Heh. You guys lost? We're trying to find this place up north called Oasis. I know about it. We're supposed it. to have a lot of good stuff to grab. Uh-oh. But we ain't interested in sharing it with every dirty waster that wanders in. So now we're gonna have to kill you. Oh, okay. Over here. Yeah. Good luck. Well. Luck was on their side, at least. Epic. Enjoy a pocket full of junk. As you ride the river sticks. Sometimes hear noises in this game. I think it's like <laughs> they are bad. They are bad. Question mark. 
they're nowhere near Oasis, it's true. Yeah, I thought they were good boys. At first. I love that you can repair knives with other knives. Like, I, I really wonder what that, what the logistics of that are. The logistics of that are double knife. <laughs> I'd be interested in visually seeing that. Any abandoned camps over here, actually? Yeah, it's right there, actually. 100% actually hours. Oh, what a beautiful view of the green scum. Yeah, this place is called the Abandoned Camp. This little hole in the wall. That's a skill book. At least that's what the Wikipedia calls this place, Abandoned Camp. Pretty cute. I'll sleep here for an hour. I'd recommend this place. I'd recommend sleeping here for an hour. Wasn't a bad experience. Not yet, at least. Uh-oh. see a red dot. Yep. Or you. Well. Really shouldn't be picking fights with max level players. PvP is on. It's a pretty new barrier. Imagine getting called noob and it really just bothering you to your to the core. Because it, it happens to me every time someone calls me a noob. Not a noob, I spent four million hours in this. God. I really care. Not a nub. Not a nub. Okay. What is Do this little save ski? Crossing off abandoned camp. Oh, there might be a. I have a landmine there that I never I didn't pick up. The abandoned camp. But it's okay. Hmm. There's a lot of stuff that's near this way station. It's a town company camp location. Yeah, you need something? Y yeah. It's right here, I think. It's pretty close by, actually. south of it. Yeah, that's about where it is. I'll be able to find it when I go to when I look at the local map. First gonna do some selling and some unloading. Okay, just want to be sure. Your FO being 90.
remember watching like like Fallout 3 content back in the early the, the late 2000s and I remember it like I remember them uh remember doing their intro thing where it was like they, they put a bunch of like cinematic filters on it and they like they like swept by this area and uh and instead of uh it said like rooster teeth or something on this instead or I think there was like a star logo I don't know I forgot what content I was looking at back in the day, but <laughs> back in 2010 or 9. That's what I was doing. What, what did I do by accident? Bats value? Get bats value. Whatever. Classic. <laughs> uh. Oops. Putting stuff in there I didn't mean to. Whoa, it's lost scrap metal. Okay, I don't think box of detergent is useful. A Broxo cleaner is, though. Like, it makes sense why I would put the sanitizer in there, but I didn't mean to. This is first set, for sure. I I did mean to put all this Lincoln stuff in here, though. I will put, I'll put the food sanitizer in there instead. Teddy bear. I might have put a camera in here already, but I could have sworn I picked up a camera. Did I put it in, in here by mistake? I did. I keep things organized. Very important. Can't be losing my cameras. Yeah. Nice. Still can't believe we have the full set. Takes a quite the quite a long time to get them all. It's like getting those those uh dragon priest masks in uh in Skyrim. Which it takes a while. <laughs> I don't think I ever got all of them. Definitely have never. Welcome. Never gone through that ordeal. Two. two. No, I, I I'm waiting for three hours, not two. Megaton. Friendly as town. Searching for a friend out. Nice. Have a look. See if anything calls out to you. I know I shouldn't be selling this stuff yet. It's all the lightweight stuff. I'm better than that. I know you're supposed to sell the heavy stuff. Cool. Recon armor. Yeah. Pleasure doing bit. Yeah. Good. All right. All round. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna let them get Looking you down. Trade. 
If the clothes make the man, then Settle here back. are the means to remake yourself. So fine, you can... No, I kind of want to keep that, actually. Got to put away my, my healing stuff. Oh. Damn it. I was going to say I, should, I could sell the stealth boys, but now I have a lot of other heavier stuff I need to get rid of first. Heavier and cheaper. And also the box of detergents. You gotta take those from me too. Sorry, I can't let you off the hook like that easily. Another. Ooh, we're getting closer and closer, folks. It's really trucking on. With our Fallout series here. Definitely not dilly dallying. No, sir. Well, no, ma'am. No, moom. Yes, moom. Oh. Well, Wolfgang, what do you got? Hey, hey, look. Hey, hey. Crazy oh, Wolfgang's come on. got just what you need. Assuming you need the random junk that I've got. A pleasure doing this. Whatever. Down, all round. Okay, it's fine. I'm not holding on to too much. Just need to get rid of the stuff in my healing items and then we'll be good. That was much faster than walking. No doubt. How much human flesh do I have? My locker. My unrefrigerated locker. What's the goal? Oh. Yeah, you started later on. Dripples. I get you. The goal of this playthrough is just to play through it all. I want to at least first uh, travel throughout the wasteland and like see as much as I can before I continue on the rest of the DLCs. I've only done the first DLC, which is uh, Operation Anchorage. And I haven't finished the main story yet, but I'm really close. And I also have just like one other quest besides the main quest left outside of the DLC. I haven't started any DLC though besides the, uh, besides what's it called, uh, Anchorage. That's the only one I've done and started and finished. Yeah, I just want to play through it all. See all the sites. I'm already max level. Because I've played so much of it already. Excuse me. There's so much to do in this game. So many things you can do. Or so many places you can go and explore for sure. I've got to put away the, my, my mole rat meat that I'm collecting. I want to check how much human flesh I had. Six. Nice. Collecting. Fun little collection of flesh. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. So many, like, I've played this game a lot in the past, so I just want to <laughs> sweep every nook and cranny and see it all. I'm really close to being done with that, because I've, I've been Welcome seeing home, all the sir. unmarked locations. And, uh, we're really close to being done with all the marked locations, too. Yoink. Okay. The opposite of yoink. Uh, place. Uh, ploink. Regardless. Oink. Oink regardless. That's how I live life. Catch his ass oinking. And boinking. He oinks while he boinks. 
Yeah, but seeing it all as a feat, thanks, yeah. And true, I, I, I love coming across new stuff in this game all the time. What the fuck? <laughs> this comes flying at you, with like, it's like some sort of Final Destination shit. Jesus. <laughs> I thought I thought I thought a grenade was coming at me or something. No, it was just a decapitated head. Okay. Uh, anyway. <laughs> yes, I love coming across new stuff all the time in these playthroughs. This one has been definitely more of that. But to the extreme sense, because we've tried sweeping the whole thing. There will be a bunch of, like, enclave camps that I don't see, I'm sure. But that I'm not... I don't think I'm missing out on too much there. So this is a very factioned location. They even got the a flag up with their logo that you never really see anywhere. Besides on their chest, I guess. You get to see a little talon. This is, what is this place called? The Talon Company Camp. No. I guess I'd say that too. An invisible man punched all the blood out of me. Like the heavy in the sandwich, meet the sandwich video. Where the heavy punches all the blood out of the scout. Punched out all of my blood. Why is there a baby? <laughs> what a logo. Evil bastards. I do this. Good. It's a very small camp. Lots of goodies, though. Good little scav. This was my haul for scabbing the wasteland today. Me voiceovering at my TikTok. I've seen that before. See how YouTube but shorts of a guy pretending they scavenged in Fallout. It's showing off their haul. Their Michael C. haul. Cool, nice little location. A copy of tumblers today can be found on the shelf in the storeroom. Did I pick that up? Not that I need it, because I'm max level, but... I didn't. It's weird that I didn't come across it. There it is. Nice. Alrighty. I don't need it. I definitely don't need it. Okay, Patriarch Picnic Area is an unmarked location in the Capital Wasteland located northeast of Jury Street Metro, south of Vault 106, and north of Vault 101, northwest of Vault 101. The remains of the road continue south there. Yao Guai can often be found seen in this area. Critter, occasional critters. A rigged baby carriage is there. The map location they show for it is like smack dab on Vault 106. This raccoon is going to the max, it's true. The min max. Silly me, thinking I can fast travel inside of somewhere. Mistake number one. N what a noob. Oh god. Yep, there's a lot of action going on here, I remember that. Oh god.
I remember why. I remember that happening last time. I'll travel north. How about that? Oh, I know there's a talent company here. Just remembered. Last time I came here, when there's talent company, they were fighting a giant rad scorpion. There's four of them. What a big spawn. Or is there three? No, it's just three. Oh, I saw a fourth one, like, crouching. Join your twin. Already then. Seems like cheating, right? Definitely seems like it. Would you be surprised if I told you? It definitely was cheating. Dumpsters. They're calling this raccoon's name. Not even when he cheats right in front of you. Yep. No cheating. Because I have my eyes closed all. Can't find this picnic ass area, ass. So I keep thinking I hear Securitrons. Those talking ones. Hi, Yagwai. Down here, maybe? Oh, there's a- this looks like a picnic area. Yeah. Yeah. Oh! They're scurrying! Through the terrain! Oh, there they go. Maybe they'll find their way to me. Whoa. Money. Hello. Yeah, well, I don't even need the second perk. Second part of the friend perk. You're right, Riku. They'll just attack on their own. Nice. Okay, so I think there's a baby carriage that's rigged around here. I'll find that to make sure this is the right location. Yep, I think I see it. Ooh. Played so much of it. Me too, Riku. Now little tips and tricks myself. So do you. I do appreciate in this version how it lets you save scum the, uh, I don't even save scum, like, like actively cheat at the hacking minigame. This arm. But also, 10 seconds. Does the level 2 of the perk actually do anything? <laughs> Bye! Want to see if it would fall. I don't, I don't know if it's gonna fall. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> um, it's supposed to make anim animals come to your aid. You're supposed to be first level is supposed to be friends, and the second one they're supposed to come to your rescue. But I don't know. 
I mean, they essentially do that on their own. They'll they'll fight like red scorpions specifically. And I don't think they fight each other anyway, like animals that are affected by the friend thing, so. Yeah, I don't know what they're what they're doing with that one. Such a patriotic picnic area with big rock. Wow. Bye bye, baby. It's like if you spot a raccoon, you give it a little treat so he doesn't kill you. Exactly, just like that. A peace offering. Okay, cool. Um, I have one, two, or one, two, three, four. So in my tabs, I have four no uh, named locations. And one, two, three, four, five, six. I have six uh, unnamed locations I still want to visit. We're really close to being done with the unnamed places. Okay, this, this place is pretty close to the big events in the main mission right now. I'm going to be sneaking a lot here. Um. Minimize. I think I might have come to this place already. I think the raider dogs attack their masters if they attack you. That's funny. I hate when they die. Me too. Yeah, a raider dog going against a regular raider. I, I think I know who wins that usually. Oh, it's all boxed off. Don't know if I can even go to this place right now. If I want to go to. Don't think I can. Ooh. I mean, I, I could, you know, TCL, I guess, but... At the end of the world, if I can't go there right now, can I go around. It's like a hole in the wall. No. Okay, I'll come back to this one later, I guess. It's just like a little shack that's along the river called like Eats Eats Shack, something like that. Um, Pirapedes, maybe. Uh, pirate. Peely. Pele's. Is a boat and bait shop. Yeah. It's near the Jefferson Memorial. Okay, Musty Caverns time. That's what I'm talking about. Near Mason Dix Dixon Salvage. Of course. Why wouldn't it be? Cool, I can fast travel. Oh, this is one of the places I want to go to. I didn't realize I haven't actually been there yet. The da uh, Drowned Devil's Crossing. Cool. Okay, it's right around here. And we're going to be walking... Went a walk in late after midnight. I know, saving every time I need to minimize my screen, I'm sure it makes a, for a lovely viewing experience. Hmm. Nice little generator. Okay. Okay. And we're looking for a place called the Musty Caverns. It's like a little hole, anthill, hovel, Calvin and Hobble. I think I see it. Oh God. No, that's not it. Just a rock. Charlie Brown, it's just a rock. Am 
I am death running. Get away. Oh, I found it. Oh god. Okay, I thought there was something huge nearby. Nope, just ants. Come at, come at me ants. I knew it would end like this. I always knew it would end with ant fights. Max are too short for death running, oh no. Okay, I might have gone, come here already. This, se this place does seem slightly searched. Oh wait, nope, that seems new. Me and the ants have a long standing rivalry. Where they try stealing my snacks, it's true. These are my snacks. I'm sorry, I know you have a queen that you need to support. Yeah, I think I've been here before. Oh, did I kill an innocent one? I don't think I did. I'll just say I think I didn't. No, that's it. That's really it. It's that small. Wow. I think this is the enemy anthill, if I recall, and the musty caverns work last time. No, it was a different one, I think. Musty cavern, unmarked location. It appears as a regular anthill entrance. The interior is almost identical to the warren. Several long, narrow tunnels dotted with fungus, amongst other things. Oh, there are two corpses in the round room. There might be nectar in the piles. Outside of the cave, a spawn point for enemies, mainly giant ants, rat scorpions, as well as death claws at high levels. Uh-huh. Okay, nothing too special. Uh... Oh, I doubt you're still here, Punk Chef, but if you are, and I guess this is relevant to anyone listening in general, I did I did see the trailer for the new Fallout series, and it does look pretty neat. I'd be down to watch it. I think I will. I just remember Punk Chef ask, asking me about it the other, other time I streamed. I think it looks good. It's very fun. Get curiously interested in the show. Mm hmm Looks like it's pretty faithful. I like the how the ghouls look and everything. I feel like there are ways you could really fuck up to the way you make your ghouls look and fall out. I'm trying to look for the corpse room. Corpse party. I, I forgot what that is, actually. Is that band? I, I don't know. And I don't know what that is. Be two bodies. It's fine. Oh, they made limited coffee. That's silly. Limited time coffee for the Fallout show. Oh, you're cautiously curious. I see. Cautiously interested in the show. You're caustically interested. Let's check out a named location. Uh. It's brighter outside. It's pretty dark when I came here. Interesting how the 
when the daylight changes, even at night. When the lighting changes. Whoa! Okay, they got launched. Whoever that was. Have I seen that location? I think so, yeah. The one with the three towers. Okay, I'm pretty sure I've never been to this location. That'll be neat. This will be neat. Hmm. Says there's a friendly. Uh oh. No more games. Time to die. Enough of that. Enough of that. Made your point. Time to let the girl go. Ladies coming with me. She made like a uh like a dead rising survivor noise. <laughs> the crying she said it sounded like it. What? One of the automated things that the survivors say <laughs> in the safe room in Dead Rising. I'm a big fan of Dead Rising, by the way. The first and the second game, I've played to death. To, to Death Rising. <laughs> and I've like 100%ed them for the most part, too. I'm like very familiar with all the aspects of those two. Dead Rising series is uh, Dead Rising 1 top tier for you, yeah. They really hit it out of the hit it, hit it out of the park so early on. They just had something clever going where it's like, okay, so we want a game where you can like mess around with all the objects and you can have fun with them, like slaying zombies. And they really just like just succeeded so well. They just they saw Dawn of the Dead, the remake, and they were like, okay, let's do that, but video game. And also let's be a Japanese company that's making things like it, and making it as American as possible. Like, yeehaw. <laughs> Ride em cowboys. Big burgers and capitalism American style. It's so awesome. And I like Dead Rising 2 as well. I just, I think the location is also cool. That's in a casino. And you can do a lot in that one. But then Dead Rising 3, it just like it strips it and turns into a weird thing, and I haven't really played that one, but I've seen gameplay. It, it feels like what they did with... Like, Dead Rising 3 feels like Dark Souls 2 to the Dark Souls series. At least in my opinion. And then the fourth one feels like that. Too, I think. And they turned, they turned Frank West into like a millennial in the fourth one. Turn to a zoomer. That's what I meant. It's actually quirky and memes all the time. Rising One's environment was so good. Uh huh. I liked it a lot too. It's very nice playing on a modern console too, with without the like excruciatingly long loading screens. All right. Well, this this is a it's quite the location. Wow. It's really noteworthy. This, this broken bridge, huh? This boulevard of broken bridge. My empire of bridge. And you can have it all. And you... Drugs and beer and stim packs, oh my. And glue. Dreamland for me. Everything I want in life. Just kidding, there's no cows. Oh my god, the Wii port. Started on the Wii port because you didn't have the Xbox 360. I think I did too, actually. I think I had the exact same situation. 
I had a friend who had an a three, Xbox 360, and I knew about the game, so I really wanted to play it. So I played it on their Xbox with them a couple times. But I never played it as much as I wanted to back in the day. I just, like, saw Let's Plays and stuff of it. Um, but yes, I did have the Wii version as well. The stripped-down, like, shop-till-you-drop Wii version. It is so funny how, like, how bare-bones it is. And how, like, boxed off, like, even some of the paths are. Or how blocked off they are. The Wii version of that game is so interesting. Like, just, like, the things they had to do to, to you know, to optimize the gameplay. To work on the Wii. I liked it, even though it, I know it's bad. <laughs> Still loved it, just because, yeah. You didn't play the OG, true. Yeah, pretty much the same boat here. Totally. I had the exact same experience, pretty much. <laughs> the Wii version is so silly. I love it, though. What a legend. Wow, I'm really checking off a lot of these locations. Yeah, I think going into Dead Rising yeah, 2 was mind-blowing, uh-huh. I, I played Dead Rising 2 before I played Dead Rising 1 proper. So yeah, the, the contrast was like night and day <coughs> with how much you could do. I had the special edition too. I really loved that series. <laughs> Excuse me, jeez. Yeah, you had the same order. Nice. I had the special edition that came with like a card pack from Fortune City and uh, gave you some chips too to the casinos. Much like how the New Vegas, it was very similar to the New Vegas, um, Collector's Edition, too. What was with that? What was with, uh, Fallout New Vegas and Fallout and, uh, Dead Rising 2? What's with these <laughs> Vegas games happening at the same time? Yeah. <coughs> Good work, Enclave. I was, like, choking on myself. I, s I swear I can't do that normally. Usually my ribs get in the way. <coughs> okay. After a sus comment like that, I'm gonna save. The Silver Lining Drive-In. Yeah, I picked up that book, got it. Cool, and then... So checking that off. Checking off the Musty. The Drowned Devil's Crossing. So yep, I did find that. Yep, got that book. Yeah, after the- so I thought- it felt very much like it was on purpose. Uh, it said, a small group of raiders, three to four, spawn, uh, at the souther southern end of the gorge after the lone wanderer enters the trailer. So yeah, there was that trailer that had a safe in it and a Tumblr's Today book. I noticed that they spawned, like, right after. Raider guard dogs are found near the- Jackknifed truck. Okay. The raiders may respawn every three in-game days, but if the dogs are killed, the raiders will not respawn. Okay. Well, I didn't see any dogs, so... I got the collector's edition of New Vegas off eBay years ago, because I have... Because you have to have one. Yeah, I know. It, it's so good. It, it, it's so cool that it comes with that, uh... The magazine. Or no, the, the uh... The comic book, huh? The comic book was really cool. That actually is, like, relevant to the game. And you can, like, find in-game locations that are based on the comic book. Like, very, very cool special edition.
yeah, I haven't read it either, but I did I did skim through it and I have like read stuff about it. <laughs> I haven't fully like I didn't read it I didn't read it in depth, but I did read like parts of it, if I recall correctly. Um Still looking at places. Jackknifed freeway truck. Unmarked location. I think I've been there already. I want to double check. There's three more unmarked locations here. One up here. Or, I mean, like, I meant marked locations. One, two, three, four. And then five. There's like five left. Five unmarked. Five marked unmarked locations left. May six with the scrapyard. Been so close. Just got rid of uh, three of them in a row. No! Not the cows! No! No! That was a mistake. There we go. Oh, great. Okay, great. No. Nope. Nope. I can't live like that. Nuh uh. Can't live with that. Going all the way from fucking Canterbury. I don't give a fuck if people get attacked out here. Damn it, that's important NPC. Nice <sighs> this is Wolfgang. Well, yeah, it's Wolfgang's ramen. Hi. Can you stop? Gonna try following them and give them full health. It's kind of on the way. Shit, there's enclave people. Please, Wolfgang. Okay. Saving. <laughs> Cowering. Hey, hey, look at that poor guy. Nothing yes. but the highest quality leftovers, junk, and no. crap. Jesus, that's a lot to sell. Never happened. <laughs> oh, great. You, you get the gist of it from the wiki, yeah. Okay, well. <coughs> Game crashed from minimization syndrome. The fuck? Oh, I remember. Looking for that special... Nothing but the highest quality leftovers, junk, and crap.
not too bad to recover from. Okay. Yeah, did not have much. Oh, hi. Stood up in the time it took. Nothing but the highest quality leftovers, junk, and crap. And crap. In case you were wondering. He does offer that, too. going on out there good god it's a lot hope oh, wolfgang is all right stays all right damn no. more to sell Saving Wolfgang. Oh god. So much shit out here. God damn, another enclave outpost. I hate this. Oh. <laughs> it's really bad for my caravanners. Half of them are dead at this point. What was this? That poor Yaogwai. Whatever. At least they're not attacking the, uh... Oh god, they're attacking Brahmin. Fuck it. Just healing through it. Definitely go on a quest to, uh, heal all the Brahmin, of course. That's what we do here. Bye. I think Wolfgang oh. is fine over there. I see him crouching. His pack ramen. Okay, I took all of his stuff. The Brahmin seem fine for the most part. Wolfgang is fine over there. Sure. Fingers crossed. Check this out. Let's try this. Oh. Wait. No, that was just the wrong word. Um. Yes. Yes. Good. All is right. Never happened. Again. I'm just gonna go chasing after them after I'm down here. Oh, it's like weird. Really? They have pre-war 
controller stuff in here. Oh, and? Oh, okay. Ultimate laser rifle. Pretty easy to come across one of those this late in the game. Sure, we got all these crappy weapons. Cool. Thank you, RNG. Inventory weapons. Department of the Army, Peacekeeping, and Recovery Field Operations Sector 27P. Inventory weapons. Type. Serial. Oh, these are the ones that were just on the table. I see. The transient, sen transient census. Spooky. <laughs> Junk finger. Hastings. Funny. That's a lot like raider names. Still way off course of where I wanted to be. No, we're not too off course, actually. We're making our way there. <clears throat> Just gonna save these guys again. Oh, that thing wouldn't have been in trouble. It would have been fine. Okay, so the place I want to go to is on the bridge, I think. I'm just going to TCL my way up there. I think I got time for this. Do I hear a... I hear like a, a chain cutter thing. What the fuck is going on? Thank God. Thank you, quick save and quick load. Oh, what the fuck? Here. Weird. Keep pressing T instead of TCL. Stupid. I think we've already cleared out this place before. Just gonna go up here. Find this unmarked location. Wow, what a view. Yeah, I'm looking for that truck over there, I think. This GNR station. Billboard, cool. I just quick saved up here. Damn it, I did it again. Wilma, get me off this crazy thing. It's one underneath me. Sounds like it. It's fine. Probably. Yeah, here we are. So this is the location. I might have been here before, but... It's just a bunch of... This equipment behind this truck. No, I haven't been here. Yeah, it was probably like a, a Chinese intelligence thing back in the day. So there was that book there for... For stealth. Well. That's what we came here for. It's 
the regulators over there. The place that I spawned into that caused Dripple to say never happened. To the cows. Come on. Come on. Do it. Do it now. There. Oh. Where's my... Where's my mouse? Who took my mouse? Where's my mouse? There it is. Okay, so that was called the Jackknifed Freeway Truck. Sure, there's a ham radio and a bunch of loot. Blah, blah, blah. Some useful loot scattered around. Sorry for this dramatic music over nothing. There we go. Ran out of music. I'm very certain I've been here already, but I just want to double check. As long as we're like, you know, clearing it all out. It's that, it's that building over there. It's a dilapidated house. Oh, the Raider House. Ow. The over... Uh, sorry, it's called the Overlook Raider Shack. It's reading the URL. Oh. Oh, my earbuds is low on power. Um. That's not good. <laughs> Using wireless earbuds right now. Well. That'll make the game more challenging. No, I don't think I actually went to this one. Oh, heal, not save. I know there's a pile of goo, but I'm not 100% convinced that I, I was the one who made it. Although I feel like last time I was here, no, resurrect them. Yeah, I know it was me. Oh, not TCL. Okay, the dog's collision is back on. Fuck, come on. There. Okay, my earbuds charge pretty fast. I'm gonna put one to, to charge a sec here. Especially because I also want to take a sec to use the bathroom. See a pooch? Oh my god. Who did that? Some loot that might be here that would be fun to check out. That's why I came back. Mm, looks like I got it already, I think. Looks like it. Yep. Yep, okay, we were here. Yeah, a bunch of limbs. I'll take you. Headstrong, I'll take you on. some more raider stuff some like raider camp encampments that go leading down somewhere around here whoa it's like some cliffside raider stuff if i recall not too far from here but i've already done that i know for sure know for a fact there's also this explosion scientist truck the scientist flings out of it yeah, here it is. These these like raider steps. That's what I remember these. Leading down here. Oh my god, Rad Scorp. Yeah, so there. Raider stuff, raider stuff, leading all the way down to like a little little wharf, if I recall. 
I want to deal with you any- uh, no. There. Happy, dealt with you. Just want to see if the scientist explodes out of here again. I think he does. Pretty sure it's like a science book that respawns. Might be wrong. I was wrong. Well, it explodes once. Ah. Okay. Okay. Um, putting the one ear bud to charge. Oh, I. Hear some of that. Hello. Here I am. Put away the nectar, sure. So many red scorp. Definitely selling some of the red scorpion glands. Been holding on to that forever. So like, wait, how many paint guns do I have? 26, okay. So like, yeah, keep 30, sell 27. Oh my gosh, I have so many fingers. I have at least five people worth of- or ten people worth of fingers. Casually on my person right now. A nice little necklace of, of, of limbs. Has a nice hash brown of teddy bears. I could repair it with stuff. Pretty sure I can only repair like non unique stuff with it, which is so weird. Oof, almost repaired it by accident. BRB in a minute. Full of liquids. Many a liquid. Well, sir. Okay. Uh, let me do some of this. Do I still have this? Okay, BRB. <laughs>
Hello. I'm going to check if the audio works. No, it does not. Okay. It works for you probably, but not for me. Uh, oh. No, it doesn't work for either of us. The fuck happened? Oh. Something weird is going on. What the fuck? Need to disconnect and reconnect my earbuds, I think. Disconnect. Connect. Okay. Well, the audio just broke. Weird. Fallout P. There we go. It just broke randomly because I put away my ear my earbuds to charge. Sounds like a thing that would happen in Fallout 3. Okay, cool. Fallout P. Cool. There's a... <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven tabs, and one of them is for the sheet music, so I want to collect all the sheet music. Let's see, Reclining Groves Resort Homes. I don't think... So that's a, a marked location that I don't feel like I explored too much. So I'm going to double-check it out. Reclining Groves Resort Homes. There's just some pictures I was seeing. It looked like there might be more than I thought. Ah. Hi. Sorry about this. I think I remember rad scorpions spawning here. Hello. I was clearly here. This place is picked clean. I think there's like a... Uh, a farmhouse around here that I might have not explored well. Oh god. Okay, I was scared. There's something on my monitor. But I thought it was a dead pixel, because it looked red. Hi again. Yep, red scorpion. Goodbye. Jeez. See the Enclave business over there? Picked up a skill book that was here before. Don't think I explored this farmhouse that much. I might have. Only like two people here. Take them on. But we're already this far sneaked. Might as well finish it off sneaked. Goodbye. Oh, 
I think I've been here already. Looks like it. Always have such valuable loot on them. It's worth a lot of caps, but not really like rare, rare or anything. Rare. Yeah, I've been here already. Okay. Oh. There's a shooting range here that I was curious about. This looks like a fun time. Good use of this ammo. Whoa. Oh, missed. Missed! Nice. Oh, yeah. Woo. Rootin, tootin. Nice shooting, Tex. <laughs> Thanks for the encouragement. Oh, they're set up to set up more. Got more cans to essentially throw up there. See? Got a little box full of them. I mean, full of them, I mean, there's like two in there. Um. Fuck, exploring that place reminded me of another place I want to check out, but I'm, it's eluding me now. Aw, oh, shoot. Whatever. Maybe if I co go back up there, I'll remember. No, I think it's beyond me. It's a number. It's way out of my purview. Yes, I remember now. Just wanted to check around the area outside with Vault 108. Thought there was like a little camp area. Hello? Yaogwai. Pretty fly for a Yaogwai. It's not the first time I've said that. I guess when there's a little camp area or something. Camp is the wrong word. Uh, picnic area. Yeah, but I guess I was wrong. I was wrong. Hello. And there's a death call. So really nothing between like like in this area, I wonder. Whoa, what did they kill? I, I saw things like flinging around over here. I just got a got a pooch. Dogs are a pretty good number on them. Oh, well I okay, and also I guess you might have helped. I like to think the dog did it, though. Blame it on the dog. Various homework incompletions and smells can be blamed on the dog. Oh, hi. Beat him to the punch, quite literally. Whoa. Let's see if I can heal from all the heavy things I've been carrying around.
Good. Good little sesh at the buffet. Wait, this is fucked. I do need to play Toontown someday on here. That'd be funny. Fun and funny. I like MMO experiences with friend with uh, viewers. Cause it's a free game, so everyone could join if they wanted to. Anyone who wants to join could. I think I'd be playing Corporate Clash. Look at all these mole rats. Oh, hello. I'd love to get back into Toontown. I played it back in the day, in the mid 2000s. I even had the. I was like a member or whatever, I think. I had the, the thing where they sent you things in the mail. Which is pretty dang cool. And the MMO is sending you like trading cards every couple of months or whatever. You get to see like a little newsletter. It's adorable. I think Toontown Rewritten has like a service that'll let you do that. Like I think there's a. There's like a. They have that service still. Just like a fun little like mock up of how it used to be back in the day. But yeah, it was pretty cool. Wow, I've never explored this like torn down neighborhood before. I'm sure there's like nothing in these houses, but still. Looks cool. Oh. Wow, Enclave all the way over here. Those trading cards had some sick artwork sick artwork you've seen yes they were they did and they're really like glossy too like they were cardboard that felt like like uh that that had like the sheen of like photo uh a photo printing what not photo printing um yeah like like when you uh print out photos from your disposable camera back in the day it had that type of like finish on it so they felt like nice quality cards too but yeah no i agree they, they, it was like really nice artwork like it looks like little paintings almost I remember reading about this how there's some uh, enclave people like burning like bodies or something some ghouls I think dropping the flamer it's way too heavy okay you can keep it I guess right yep these are ghouls. Sure, I'll take that. Hi. Didn't even notice. Rube. Oh yeah, uh, Corporate Clash, Toontown Corporate Clash is really nice, it's, it's like, so Toontown Rewritten kind of tries to be very faithful to Toontown. I have an account on both that I've like lost track of, but I'm sure I could find again. But, um, Rewritten is neat, how faithful it is to the original, but, um, Corporate Clash is just like, is, is like the same game, but modernized, it's very nice. You can actually, yeah, the, the way you, um, <laughs> it's kind of funny. You can kind of screw yourself over in Corporate Clash, though. You can start a build, I'm pretty sure, where it's like, <laughs> you get to choose two gags at the start of the game. I'm pretty sure you can choose, like, a lure gag and healing, so that you literally have no way of, like, damaging them. <laughs> the lure gags and the healing gags. But it's, I mean, there's a lot of cool things, though. Like, there, you can be a lot of different animals in it, and you can, like, change your animals at will. You don't have to be, like, locked in forever. You can change your name all the time, I'm pretty sure. They're just, like, very nice things. That you would have wanted. <laughs> Immediate support build lock. Soft lock, yes. Uh-huh. Like, I can even be a raccoon in that game. They have raccoons. 
tons of animals that weren't in the original games. And it seems very, like, lovingly made. Like, it doesn't seem like it's, a uh, like, you know, the cheap, what is it, the the corporate cash grab that the literal first game was. Or it had, like, like, the first game has so much stuff that, like, prolongs it, the, the original version. Like, a lot of things that are meant to be just, like, tedious and annoying. Like, like farming in that game, the gardening, is the worst. <laughs> like, I love farming in RuneScape. RuneScape's farming is so fun. I don't know why, but I'm, like, really high level in it because I found it satisfying just to get rewarded for waiting, I guess. I don't know. Feels like Farmville. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever enjoyment you get out of Farmville, I'm sure, is the same thing. I mean, same with, like, you know, Stardew Valley or whatever. Just the enjoyment of farming, but... Um, yeah, so, um, the farming in, <laughs> in Toontown is so bad. You have, like, you have to just, like, log in to water it once at once a day, and then you just, <laughs> it just, like, you wait for the water meter to go away over time, and you get experience for just watering the plants. It's, like, really, really basic. And then you have to, like, destroy the plants at the end. You never touch Toontown farming, yeah. You, 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 like, um, it was just, like, you got the, like, little garden trellises around your house that you can plant jelly beans in to get little flowers. And there's, like, combos of flowers to do certain things. Um, and then there's, like, this whole system of, like, getting enough experience to, uh, upgrade your watering can. But it just takes forever. It's, like, it's, like, you need 200 experience to upgrade your watering can, and you get one experience per time you water. So you have to, like, just... Be constantly circling around your house, watering your plants once a day for like a week straight to get an upgrade. Like, I, I, I'm kind of describing RuneScape, which is kind of funny in a sense, but it just it's it's like a much worse version of RuneScape. I'm just realizing the overlap of how that sounds, kind of like the systems in RuneScape. But yeah, no, it's it's really bad. There's there's other things too. You can plant like gag trees, so you can get some free gags, but they're they're never, like, worth it, because a gag is worth, like, what, one jelly bean normally? So to have a tree that gives you some free gags, it's like, okay, so you're, you're you know, you spent all this time to save, like, what, like, five jelly beans? And then it's the system for, like, planting your trees is weird, and you can only get a certain set amount in, like, your area. It takes forever for them to grow, but if they die, you can, like, water them once, and they're back to life. So there's, there's like, no point of, like, actually taking care of them, I think. I don't know. It's it's doesn't make sense. I think Corporate Clash has. I don't know what their like watering system is like, but I think they they probably make it bearable, like everything else in the game. They make all the unbearable stuff bearable. So I seem to have a lot to say about the game. So I'll probably have a fun time playing it again. Don't know why I talk like a redditor half the time. I'd have a rather fun time playing it, me ha me thinks. It's good to see you alive and well, sir. At least I'm self-aware enough to know that I, I sometimes talk like a fedora wearing neckbeard, but I am. Mmm, quite. <laughs> Away a bunch of junk and going back into the wastes as we do. Yay! We love Fallout. Fallout is our favorite. When you join Squint on his streams, he just always asks Squint, "When are we playing more Fallout? I want more Fallout." You know what? I'll I'll always oblige. Just kidding. I'm getting sick and tired of this shit. <laughs> Triple just kidding. It's it's fun, I swear. Uh, no one's forcing me to do this. Unless one person says so, and then I have to. Okay. Okay, so that was the, rec the reclining groves resort homes. I got rid of that location. So, yeah, the, the two other locations that I have that are named locations are just, like, things that I'll come across on my own. 
that, that are like already marked that I haven't visited. So so I know exactly where they are, because they're like the the unmarked marked places. You know. You know. Oh, I had two. <laughs> I, t I think I had two tabs open for the Reclining Groves Resort Homes. Weird. When it comes to unmarked locations, there are three of those, and then two marked locations. There's the Hilltop Farm Ruins, the Ghoul Outpost, which I think I've already seen, and then the Pirate P Pelly's, spelled Pirate P-L- P-E-L-Y. Pirate Pelly's. That's the place I couldn't go to because the Enclave. Let's go to the Hilltop Farm Ruins. Supposedly there's two skill books there. Neat. Might have been here before, but we'll see. Damn, we are really close to being done with all this wasteland business, and then we'll do the DLCs, and then we'll be fully 100% at a Fallout. If there's any games that I'd like to 100%, Fallout 3 would have been one of them. I'm very happy that I decided to go on this journey. I've had a lot of fun. It's so nostalgic playing this game. Just grew up with it. Oh, I see it. I think so. I think that's the farmhouse. I see like a windmill. And uh, I've seen Courage the Cowardly Dog, so I think I know what a farmhouse, what a windmill means. Yeah, exactly. Every nook and cranny searched, no stern, stone unturned. It's true. Don't mind me, I'm just sl sloshing soda for my voice. Oh, what's this? I'm sure soda's great for your voice, right? I'm sure all voice actors are known for drinking copious amounts of soda before I take. Oh. Well, good thing I'm not a voice actor. I'm a streamer. I'm a let's player. I'm pretty sure those are fueled on soda. Okay, fuck it. Oh. My earbuds are dying again. Just my left one. Who needs stereoscopic audio, anyway? Thought you were clipping through. I'm legit putting that other earbud on the charge right now. Okay. We'll do, uh... Do this location one eared. Fallout challenge. I don't tend to streamers who do this though. Mr. Critical. Mr. Charlie Day Critical. You I think he's usually seen with just one earbud in. I let my earbud hang low. So you know it's legit. Anyone here? Doesn't sound like it. Doesn't smell like it. I mentioned him earlier and oh. Hey, hold on. Punch. Ooh. Whoa. I'll read all those in a sec. I was just gonna say, I, I've been, I talked about him earlier, this YouTuber named Dank, Dank Buds. Dank Pods. Which is a very fun YouTuber. He always says, uh, when he wants to listen to something, he'll, he'll give it a smell. I'll give it a smell. Sorry, this is 
canker sore developing in my mouth that's hurting me <laughs> ever so slightly. Um, but yeah, I think it's funny that he says he gives things a smell. Oh, this is the earbuds here. Let's give him a smell. So, me talking about my earbuds and mentioning smell made me think of that. The more you know. Definitely, definitely recommend his channel. Dank, dank pods. He's a fun boy. He yells at things and his pet snake. Apparently snakes can't hear things, so... It's not abuse. <laughs> oh, hello everyone. These are probably the people that are from the uh, terminal. No, they aren't. Hello. Have you heard? A man named Hannibal Hamlin is gathering all He's very unique hair, this guy. ...at a safe place called the Temple of the Union. Finally, people are standing up against the slavers. Wow. We're on our way to join Hannibal's cause. Oh, trust me, I didn't know all about it. I've helped him. Look a little lost. You need directions. I'm sure it'll give me good karma. Do you know Hannibal Hamlin? Do you know where the temple is? Also, now he's like at the uh, Lincoln Memorial now. This guy's a little late. Yeah, the temple is in the Lincoln Memorial near the Washington Monument. <laughs> right. It's not far northwest of DC. Real friendly people there. Uh oh. Northwest. What is there? Or probably the Enclave? I don't know. I don't like that. Yeah, I'll help them. Thank you, friend. We won't forget this. Yay. Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, what is it? Um, Obi-Wan. Hello there. Hello there. Okay. I got the two skill books that were at this location. Okay. Oh, I need to read all those entries. That'd be cool. Saved. Just wanted to check the, uh... Check the wiki about this place. The house contains a terminal which chronicles the life of a group of wastelanders who lived there shortly after the Great War. The authors of various terminal... The authors of various terminal entries are Doc, this person, blah blah. In addition, four more residents called blank blank and blank are mentioned in the notes. Cool. Playground could be found outside. Just reading a little bit about this. Yep, not much more to say about it. Okay. The next place is the Ghoul Outpost after I read that terminal. Oh, the Ghoul Outpost is very close to the, uh, to the sewers we were at at one point. But damn, after this, sewer outpost, or ghoul outpost, and then just a few more marked locations, and then we're done. Wowza. Here, let me go through all of them again. <laughs> I've been repeating myself every so often. I think we'll hit up the ghoul, the ghoul outpost, and then call it a stream for tonight. <clears throat> Give myself a stretch. Entry Edgar. Well, I got everyone to agree to let me set up some generators for power. I can understand their nerves, considering what technology did to all, did to us all but not making us use it. Not making use of every resource is wasteful and a sure path to hell in this situation. Coming out into the light has done wonders for everyone, but we all can get a little stir crazy, even out here. I'm setting this thing up for everyone to use. Cool. I'm dozing off, but I'll leave the stream up. Oh, have a good night. Yeah, it's getting late. Thanks, Dripples. You're lots of fun. Thanks for your company. Have a good night. Rochelle. Just like in Left 4 Dead. We set up a... Irrigation system. Yay. 
Thank God for Miles' experience. Miles' experience on the farm. I never would have thought of this on my own. But what a great idea. I really thought this ground was useless, but the stuff he had us plant in the dirt we dug up is actually sprouting. Aw. And the little rivers keep it all nice and wet. Cute. Tyrone. My turn to be the boss this month seems stupid to me. I don't want to be in charge. I'm just going to do whatever Jim tells me to do. Okay. Dr. J. I want to remind everyone that to come by my tent every day for your radiation screening. Even if you don't think you've got exposed... You gotta... Fuck. Even if you don't think you've been exposed to radiation, the test takes only minutes. Take my word for it, you'd much rather be inconvenienced in the morning than come down with a case of radiation sickness. I'm more than happy to give a detailed account of that scenario to the next person who misses an appointment. Uh-oh. Tyler. Uh, Tyler. Two from Tyler. My name is T.Y. and I'm a big dumb head. Uh-oh. Hey, Rochelle, remind me what a big stupid head I am the next time you need me to repair you and Vu's distill, uh, distillers, okay? What gives, Edgar? Can't you put a password on this thing? Funny, Jim. Been a good few months for us since the coming out. Aw, oh, good work. So proud of them. Going by the disometer tests, we've taken some exposure to radiation. But as long as Doc Johnson keeps folks on... That's right, Doc J, of course. Johnson. Uh, keeps folks on their meds. We don't seem to be having trouble with rad sickness. Irrigation and fertilization has been good. And though we lost the goats and chickens, aw, the cows have done good. Of course they have propagated the earth. Those hardly, those hardy beasts don't seem to mind this new world. Miles and Jackie are devoted, are devoting some time to husbandry to keep the cows breeding and available. Wow. Relatable. Edgar. Trying to fabricate a windmill for us. If anyone spots any long, flat sheets of other, of metal, you let me know. I have most of the other parts I need, but haven't found a good sh metal. Haven't found good metal for the blades yet. From last entry, Jim. Nobody ought concern themselves too much with Miguel's scouting report. While he did spot some folk out past the valley, they rode by some and weren't like, like, and weren't like to have noticed him or us. Okay. Let's all just keep to the homestead and for, for a few days and avoid using open fire for a few days. Just to be safe. Cool. Sorry to hear it didn't make out, it didn't work out. Probably. I mean, I don't see them here anymore, so. R.I.P. Shroom. Shroomish. Hey, okay, sweet. Enemy, I swear. Danger. Oh. Oh, that's just one bloat fly. Bloat fly in the buttermilk shoe fly. Bloat. Bloat in the buttermilk shoe fly. Bloat. Oh god, that's a big, that's a big fly. It's not even a fly. On and a baby. R.I.P. Cool. Wait, did I? Yeah, that's the house I explored. Okay. It's the homestead house. Okay, I've swept so much of this place. That was even the Temple of the Union I think I zoomed in on. Yeah. 
cool. Got the clifftop shacks. These three locations. Faded Pomp Estates. Then Roosevelt Academy, I know it's three buildings. Three buildings, and then the Mass Relay Station. I'll check if I visited half of these places around there. Um, Abandoned Car Fort. Yep, okay, I remember this place. Yep. Okay, did I, exp did I go to the Axles? Don't recall if I ever actually explored this place. Scoop on mutants. Oh, no, I didn't. Maybe I didn't, but they're all asleep. Rip. 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 I think I would have cleared out all, all the drugs if I were here before. Very unfair fight, I know. Very unfair of them to go 3v1. I think I saw a... I think there's a super mutant over there, yeah. Looks green. Green behind the gills. Sometimes it just doesn't let you hop again. Not even drugs, just meat. Not even meat I can eat. What gives? No drugs, no edible meat. What gives Fallout? Something's gotta give. Oh! Wow, a holotape. That gave. Parcel CB radio backup? Come again, come again. Any truckers on this wave? Oh. No trucker is found. Wonder if there's any lore behind that recording. I'll look it up. I'll check it out. It's up there. Let's see here. Five axles. Raider holdout. Shooting the four trucks from a distance will cause them to explode, most likely killing or severely injuring the raiders encamped there. Oh, there's a mini nuke in the trailer. There's a mini nuke and a U.S. Army 30 handy firearm recipes book there. There's a short hollow disc, yeah, entitled Parcel CB Radio Backup. Those are landmines around, too. Oh, I guess I did. I was here. It looks like I was here then. I see an image of where the, uh... Where the stuff would be. I'm pretty sure I've been here before. Yeah, there would have been, like, right back there. Next to the, uh... May over here. No, on this side. Near the, uh, paint guns that I picked up. Not that I didn't pick up the... The drugs last time, just got, I guess I didn't see them. This plunger seems like something I might drop. Here's to see if there's anything on that. No, that's a monorail. That's not like a. Yeah. Still curious to. Oops. I'm curious to still look at, look at it. Look at it. Look at it. 
This is like a general location I haven't been to much. Let's see what the monorails looked like when they were in service. Ooh. Whoa. My guts. I think this is an unmarked location known as like the monorail wreckage. There's a couple of them though. A couple of monorail wreckages. Just taking a little peek around. I think that's Roosevelt's place. A little flyby. Yep, looted. I think I, I thought I remembered looting this truck. I think I also TCL'd my way here, possibly. Last time. Yep, I visited that stuff. Okay. Another save. Up. Okay. Um. Google outpost. Can't believe I'm getting rid of all these tabs. Boy, so close to being done. A lot easier knowing that thing is truly dead. Glad I could help out with the bomb, like 40 episodes ago. I know we're not 40 episodes, but we are close. Seems so close to the last place we were. The uh, really close to the uh, the sewers we were at last time. Like right around here, I'm trying to pinpoint it. Looking for a cool outpost. gonna walk there on my own or not my what am I saying I think I'm just gonna like TC on my way there don't want to deal with enemies what the fuck it's so complicated where it is instead of just being directly south I don't know why it's being so weird Walking straight up for a sec, don't mind me. Just want to avoid everything. Yep, this is the place I was before. The, uh, Talon Company. This is what happens when we, we're going to the last unmarked location, okay? We're gonna... Just gonna take a, the clearest path there. Oops. What's going on here? It's the raider. Yep. Bonk. Ooh. You're really excited for a sec there. Then his hopes got dashed. Rainbowly. It's like this, around here. Saving constantly. Yep. It's very close to the sewer place again. Remember this merchant. Scavenger. Okay. Oh.
Oh, wait, no, it's way closer to the ten penny can- what? Really? Hmm. Looks like it's really close to the talent camp, actually. I went way farther than I needed to. I made a save here, so... I'll be back if I need to be back, but... Across the street from here. This little area, I think. Seems kind of close to Great Itch, too, like where all the chunk is in Great Itch. Seems like it almost. Rangled Station. Ants spawn here. Okay, fine, I'll fight these, like, few fire ants. I think these are the last ones to spawn. Oh, no, these aren't fire ants. I was pretty sure the fire ants didn't respawn, so I was surprised if it was actually them. Nice try. Keep trying that. Goodbye. Oh, ah. Uh. Poor guy. There's like a repeating quest for Dr. Lesko, the guy from the, the doctor from the Great Itch stuff, I'm pretty sure. And uh, his, his repeating quest is to give him nectar from the fire ants, but there's like really limited amount of nectar, I think. So it's a repeatable quest that's pretty finite. I think maybe they spawn underneath again, but I'm not, like, in, in Marigold Station, but I'm not 100% sure on that. Ah, what exploded? Oh, here it is. The outpost. Pretty sure this is it. Yep. Oh, they're enemies. Poor guys. You like that? This isn't worth it. It's not worth killing them over this. Hostile ghouls. I mean, they're they're. I w I know they attacked me, but I have no real harm. I w I don't want to cause them any harm, so I'm just gonna sneak in here and. Scavenge around. Look out. They think they think there's someone here, but there's no one here. I'm invisible. I don't know what they're talking about. Oh my god, I have so much stuff I can repair. It's over encumbered, but I won't be for long. Oh my gosh. Had enough. We haven't started, but he had enough. Who are they killing? Oh. I see. Well, that's neat. Going one eared for this for a good time, good amount of time now. I'm working out pretty all right. Got some chunk I need to throw away. Leaf flower, not that heavy. Oh my god, all those. Those are weighing me down though. Vacuum cleaner was heavy though. Wherever you are. Ten pounds. 
Oh, it's very hard to open this one. It's brute that they're keeping in here. I think they'll win. I have good, I have strong feelings about their side in this battle. It's one-sided battle. Let's, yeah, I'm gonna drop a ton of this junk. Here, have some more weapons that you might be able to use. I'll give you a super knife. Maybe they'll exchange for a different one. Uh oh, that's bad. Ouch. Sorry about that. I really thought that was a real one. Oh, they actually. Oh no, I thought they got him. I'm going to find you. Oh, sorry about that guy. I kind of broke your leg un unintentionally here. That'll be nice. Again, I didn't want to do any harm, so. Uh. There. It's all good. Watch out. Where did you go? There you are. I wasn't expecting this place to be hostile. This is just gonna be an outpost for you know for uh ghouls just to be chill. Kind of is for them. For their side. Oh, I'm encumbered with all the junk. I just need still picking up more as I say I, oh oh no. Oh my god. I think you all know what's gonna happen here. Uh-oh, I didn't mean to... Un fuck. Okay, well, I... The thing that's gonna happen here is I'm gonna TCL out of here. Or not TCL. The other thing. I'm gonna COC out of here. Let them have their fun. I'm just curious to see, did they kill the mutant? They did not. I do not think so. I see red dot there. Okay. I think it's my Megaton house. Megaston. Like a house. Ah! Oops. Is it Megaton Player House? It's that, isn't it? There we go. Agreed is real. Okay. I'm curious to go back there, if I'm being honest. I got all the stuff out of it, so... I just legit want to see how things are in there. Still blood on my screen. I just couldn't stand being over-encumbered and... Needing to jump onto that one counter, the last counter I need to check out. I'm just curious to see if, uh, if things have settled down in there after you quick travel out of there. It's not that big of a deal if I end up having to hurt them. Yep, they're all good. Nice. almost gone. You know what? Watch out. They can have fun with that. Hello. I won't Who's interfere. There? Who's there?
Oh, okay then. Give it a little save. I'm gonna read up about that location for a sec. Uh huh. Cool outpost. Small camp inside of a building located northwest of the Mar or southwest of Marigold Station. Well, three hostile ghouls and a jailed super mutant. Oh, I just remembered there's scraps of metal in that location because the the thing that exploded. I think I picked up the mini nuke, yeah. I'm pretty sure I recall doing that. Hmm. Turn left at the T and continue along the road and pass through the barricade that says, Welcome to Gradage. It's reading about how to get there. Uh-huh. There may be ghouls, but they may be ghouls, but they are in the raider faction, and the ghoul mask has no effect. Interesting. Okay, cool. Checking that off the list. And with that, we have Pirate Pelly and uh, Sheet Music, the Capitol Building, and Roosevelt Academy. Academy. These are the last four tabs I have for the Fallout series. You did it. Thanks, Riku. I appreciate it. Appreciate your company and hanging out for this victory. Welcome home, sir. Oh, wow. We're so close to being done with the wasteland that we can do the DLCs. Of course, all. So close to DLC time. I'm still holding off the quest for Tenpenny Tower because I don't want the the bad outcome. <laughs> I'm gonna save this one empty syringe. Oh, this close to King Raccoon. So close. go through the fun of uh I'm emptying my inventory. You know what that means. Waiting around. And eating a bunch of junk. Won't have it any other way. That's all I do in life. I wait around and I eat junk. It's life for me. Yar har fiddle dee dee. Raccoon's life is for me. Do what you want, cause a raccoon is free. You are a wily coyote. Ah, yep. Wolfgang's okay, yay. Looking to trade? Was able to keep them alive. Crazy wolf oh. has got just what you need. But at what cost? Assuming you need the random junk that I've got. Oh my god, the stealth armor was on a hair well, of health. Two megaton. Can't wait in this area. I thought there was enemies nearby or something. No, just was acting weird. Into oh, Hoff, stay. haven't seen you in forever. I'm glad you're alive. Looking to trade? I've not seen the yellow jumpsuit guy in forever, though. I have Tell to me what you need, respawn him. And maybe I've got your fix. Oops. Too expensive. Too rich for his blood. Okay. With three nuka calls. Two sugar bombs, nice. Cool. Another Another sad customer. They know me too well. I 
R.I.P. Ben Canning. I sure did delete him from existence. I feel like I'll only see Doc in this guy. I go to the gun sellers in uh Hello. in Rivet City too. Hello. You better a not nice lady. Shopping at Lachique. What about trouble? Did she say you caused enough trouble? Did she say you've caused enough trouble? My god, my voice right now. Slurring every word together. Oh, take that for the collection. Buy out like all of her good ammo. So I can sell like one laser rifle. Come on, please. Don't want to buy that, that ammo. If I can help it. Oh, but I don't think I can. I'll buy stems. There. Just want to get rid of that gun that I'd never be able to- Oh my god, the plasma rifle. Speaking of which, the guns I'll never be able to sell off because they're too expensive. It's too well prepared. Repaired. The rapport is too good. When the rapport is too good. It's been a pleasure- It's been a cannings. If you call, if you talk to, talk to Uncle What's-His-Face, tell you, oh, okay, you can, they can tell you if he's dead or not, I didn't know that. I actually want to try that. See if he's walking around. Yeah, I forgot his name too. I know who you mean. Also, hi. Hey, staying out of trouble? Good. Cool. Who's out there? It's Wolfgang. I'm just gonna. Whatever. We're just gonna get rid of him. There he is. Are you okay? Uncle Ro. What can old Uncle Ro? Talks about caravans. Sure thing. Weapons. Then you'd be looking for Lucky Harith, adventurer. He's a bit of an eccentric. That simply isn't feasible, I'm afraid. You can usually find one of the trade care of... Other than them, Porter's always got food for... No, can't find out from him, I guess. No cough is still around. I guess they're still talking about it means... Then you'd be... He's... Our man Crow. He grew up a tribal... Cool. At least we know he's alive. Good. Hi, Joe. What's up? What's up? Take Ooh, he's got a Let few caps. Stem... No. Anuka. Nice.
Oh man, this is gonna take a while to sell off. Not too long. Give me it's like a two more trips somewhere. We said they haven't checked in a while. That means they're dead. Uh oh. Okay, I assume they all they all didn't say they haven't checked in in a while. I'm just gonna assume that. Activate. There. Finally done for. These things have been plaguing me forever. Pretty sure they're normally not there. They just, during like the... The one fight they had outside, I, I kind of deactivated them. A friend with deep pockets. Nothing oh my god. Quality, oh my god. Junk and crap. 2,000. Oh boy. It's like hitting it big on the stock market in uh, Animal Crossing. Oof. I thought it would take me forever to sell the rad scorpion things. Nope. Goodbye. Um, I'll, I'll save that, whatever. Pog. Wow. That really helped out. Thank you. Thank you, Crow. Uh, can I sell him, like, one more thing? I was carrying this junk around. Oh, 1,001 caps, hey oh. Or 10,001, I meant. That means we can buy another upgrade. Pleasure doing okay. Let's finish up selling junk in Rivet City. Oh, I heard a car alarm going off for a sec. I was worried. It's gonna go off for a while. Hello. Hello. Good to see you. You too. Nice to see you. It's locked for a reason. Don't get any up. Welcome to Potomac Atom. They weren't there. Wonder what time probably time of day or whatever. The uh, gun guys weren't there. The gun life partners. Heterosexual. Okay. Thanks. Sell it to the Thanks. other guy too. Still no. Hello. There he is. Grapnel. You want any of this shit? Just. Very confident. Oh. Ordinance. City ordinance. Want an explosion. Thank you. Vote for a new city ordinance. Cool. Wow. Right on the money. Ooh, one Duca Cola away. Another satisfying. Hey, stranger. Nice to see you again. Cool. Keep the one cap. Give me a shout. Want to buy a girl it's a like drink. a penny. Hey, you make it quick. I'm on a tight schedule. Uh, nope. Don't mind you. Me. Welcome to Gary's Galley. Okay, you're noted into a clipboard. Sounds good. Um, what do you have? Yes, valuable 
valuable money I can buy off you. With the barter system. Maybe one? No, no, no new cola. Too good to be true. Okay, we get to add at least one more perk though. That'll be fun before we go off tonight. Before we go off, King. God, I sound so tired. No. So sweepy, eepy. Another satisfied. Okay, that's I think that's enough selling. Ah, fuck. This guy usually has stuff. Oh, if he was here. This is where I put one if he was here. Eepy hours. Okay. I say I want to put something away. I'm so EP, I forgot even what I even said I wanted to do. Oh, I want to give myself another perk. I remember now. Perk, perk, perk. The perks of being a raccoon. Welcome home, sir. Oh, you probably have Good water. Morning, sir. Dope. Good let's morning, sir. let's let's haircut. Certainly, I am programmed with a multitude of hair-shaping scenarios. If you would care to choose one, I would be happy to replicate it for you. Oh, looks great. Just want to clear out. Tell me a joke. Ah, do you know the best contraceptive for old people is nudity? Ha. Huh. Well done. My... I will not be needing any contraceptives, thank you. Why would anyone need any of those? It's beyond me. So many frag grenades. I'll be so ready to start off the next stream by blowing everything up. Just have one vodka on me. I can stay on. That's not the end of the world. As we know it. I'll put away the one cap. Bottle cap on a grenade. Land mine. Fuck. Cool. I really never use the shish kebab. But I still keep it on me. We'll keep that thing on me. Okay, time to go to the list of perks. Uh, I'm just gonna give myself a rad absorption bucket. And then we'll read what it does. It's the next one on my list anyway. Yes. Rad absorption. Rad absorption. Cool. Let's see what it does. Rad absorption. With the rad absorption perk, you slowly... Your radiation level slowly decreases on its own over time. Hell yeah. It's gonna be nice. No longer even needing to touch the infirmary. Gotta give up my 10k. Okay. Yeah. It's already gone down by one rad. Yes. Wait, I'll... Still do this for now, though. Don't, don't even use... I, never, I haven't used chems in so long. Still feels force of habit to detox myself. Um... It's 31 scrap metal. Pretty big haul. 
I'll just do that and then call it a night. And one more thing. And one more thing. So EP. Uh. I'm just too lazy to type TCL. I have to select it from the previous. Just have to. Yeah, Walter. Yeah, what is it? Yeah, uh. Metal. Oh. Well Woo. 310. Love that shortcut. <laughs> Give myself rad absorption too. Not a real thing. Woo. Thanks everyone for joining me. It was lots of fun. Had a great time. Hope you all had a good time too. Love playing Fallout and hanging out with everyone. Had a very full stream of goofs and jokes and ha ha he he's ho ho's and twinkies but yeah thank you everyone for joining me time for ep hours yep have a good night riku thanks for spending the night with me i'll see you all in the next one night night bye bye